Ryan, why don't you uh, tell us why we've been so busy? Uh, we picked up some jobs. Oh yeah, and those jobs are the editor are being the editors of Game Grumps, Kitty Cat Gaming, and Oni Plays, as well as continuing our editing practice on Super Mega and that just our is general. Right. Don't be scared. We're still releasing a video a day. That is our goal, a video a day, and we. Hopefully we'll always reach it unless sometimes we um, get too busy, but hopefully we're uh, getting backlogged enough at this point to where that sh it, it shouldn't be a problem. Aaron and Dan from Game wow. Grumps. Hey guys, welcome to episode 55 of the Super Mega Podcast. Very special guest today. You know him. His name is Aaron Hansen. Say hi, Aaron. Why? All right. Oh, well. Well, I'm Matt Watson, here with Ryan McGee. That's me. And uh, we're going to talk about a lot of fun stuff today. Well, my, my th this place I went to, Crispy Deli, it was great because it was like this one guy and he owned it. And I guess his son worked there too. But like, th so there was like this bar where you could eat at next to the, the counter. It was super tiny hole in the wall place. And the bar was always covered in, in like newspaper because he would just sit there when it was slow and read the newspaper. And he had this stack of cookies <laughs> that he would just like work on for days. <laughs> Like, he would just eat, like, a half a one Wait, okay, a day. okay, I was expecting, like, three or four, like, cookies. You're telling he had a day's no, worth of a stack it, no, of cookies. No, it was, like, some weird, like, Belgian cookie that got, comes in, like, a tube, and he would just, like, peel it down like a, like, Dude, spree. is it the red stuff? Does and it have, like, chocolate cream in the middle? No, it was oh. just, like, a shortbread cookie. But every time I go in there, it would be, like, at varying heights, because he always had one that he was, like, working on, and whatever fucking newspaper or something, and it was just, and it was just covered like, you couldn't eat at that bar that was made for people to eat at because he would use it for his uses. That's the man's newspaper bar. But, man, he made a good fucking... And then one day I went in there. Like we, we ate there almost every day. And then one day I went in there, and uh, he was like, Hey, my friend. And I was like, hey, yeah, man, yeah. And he's like, you come here a lot. You, you are a friend. And I was like, cool. And then he handed me this little box, and I was like, okay. And then I opened it up, and it was like it was like a little flashlight keychain with like <laughs> with like crispy deli Wait, on it. What? <laughs> yeah. He gave you a present? <laughs> yeah. That's so lucky. That's no, so like, nice. I was like, whoa, dude, thank you. <laughs> That's like a completely different sentiment from like like I'll just give you a free sandwich. It's I mean, like I got this little flashlight <laughs> keychain for you. That's so lucky. Here, promote my store. Thank you. <laughs> it's like, yeah, I come in here to, to, to light up my home. I come in here to fucking... You know, my, my power's been out for a couple weeks now. This is just what I needed. You, Thank you. You think if I was like, no, instead, give me one of your cookies, he'd be like, no. No. Do you remember? Yeah. Uh, Ryan and I got into an Uber with this Armenian guy, <laughs> and, and he started, like, talking to us. The first thing he said, like, we get in the car, and this, like, woman walks by. Um, well, she's a large, barrel-chested woman. Uh -huh. And he's like, oh, she got the high beams on. And I was like... Uh huh? He's like the high beams, and he pointed. I was like, oh, <laughs> yeah. And I just kind of like awkwardly laughed along. And the whole drive, he started talking about really sexual stuff. And he was women, like, they talk, they talk, but they fuck. Yeah, he was just. He was like, <laughs> he was like man, you know, I the smartphone is the greatest invention, man, because you got. You know, girls in real life, they, they talk and they get up in your face and argue, and you gotta buy them shoes. But with the smartphone, you got them on a screen. You got millions of them. And you get weird shit, like you get women with dicks. And I was like, <laughs> all right. <laughs> and Ryan was just like, yes, yeah, sex. <laughs> There's a whole video recording, like audio yeah. recording. Uh, and Ryan was like, oh, sex, yes. And the guy was like, yeah. I like, don't get that, man. Like, dudes will. I was in a Best Buy once and I just like bought American Psycho on DVD. And, and this guy was like, hey, what, was that, is that a good movie? And I was like, oh, yeah, man, I love this movie. That's why I'm buying it. And he's like, oh, yeah, this, what's what's the sound quality like on that? And I'm like, I don't know, man. I guess it's, you know, it's, it's, maybe it's, I don't know. I'll check out the back. Oh, it's, it says it's uncompressed. That's cool. And say, like, yeah, man, that's cool. That's cool, man. Check out the tits on that girl. <laughs> that's just weird like, as shit, like, dude. What? Like, it's not, we're not. How is that, like, the number one thing to go to? Yeah. Oh, man. How about the vagina, dude? <laughs> it's nice. It's I like, wish I could see her vagina, <laughs> but the, I can't. It's like <laughs> sad and miserable. Damn it! It's always like so. <laughs> <laughs> it's so uncomfortable. Darn my lucky me. stars! When when guys like try to like when guys I don't even know try to talk like sexual stuff, it's like yeah, dude, let's open up about our sexuality. Yeah, like, man. man. Look at her breasts. I just like, yeah, dude. you know, like in the movies, he's like, dude, did you get to have sex with her? Yeah, dude. I wish it was just like, dude, did you have sex with her? Yes. Oh, imagine me. You should just like completely gross somebody out and just be like, you know, it's like, check out the tits. I'd just be like, man, I'd like to stick my 12 inch cock between those, those bazongas and just, and just in and out and in and then go. 
to like to, to like spin it and just, just imagine spinning. me naked fucking that woman like just really make it super uncomfortable for the guy Dude, well, i thought we were talking about sex though yeah it's like what what the hell this is what guys talk about have you ever had a book signed aaron by a uh, famous person? Yeah, I got I got an art book signed by uh, Yo Yoshinari and oh, uh, awesome. Imaishi. Yeah, it was an art book by them. I got an art book signed by uh, James Gurney, the guy that made Dinotopia. Oh, really? Yeah, my dad my dad uh, was like friends with him. It's like cool. legendary. Yeah, that's awesome. He got me a little signed poster and everything. Yeah, well, uh, I got an autograph uh, by Penn and Teller. So. Do you really? Yeah. That's so, a lie. They give those out for no, free I'll... after every show. Stop. Aaron. They, they have like a meet and greet where you can just Stop. come up and take pictures Aaron. of them for free. After every Matt, show, they don't. You just pay admission Matt, and you just Aaron, see them outside. Stay out of this, Matt. I promise. Like you I literally, think, you can't miss them me. when you walk out. They're right there after the show, and they meet every fan. I got a signed copy of the Bible. <laughs> yeah, it's signed by my friend George. <laughs> <laughs> Dad signed it when I was born. I got a, uh, I got a signed copy of Sneaky Steve though. So what the fuck, is dude? Steve? I have like. I think I have two copies of Stinky Steve, and then what is I Stinky Steve, the Minecraft book which I have read. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I've read. Wait, wait. Is it one of those books that's like unofficial yeah. Minecraft book? And it's like forty pages. I read the whole thing in about fifteen minutes. It was terrible. <laughs> Damn. And also, uh, I we have like twenty or twenty about twenty Minecraft fan fiction books because people mail them to us. I have about five copies of Hero Brian Goes to School. <laughs> if you want one, yeah, I'd love it. I could bring it Do in. Do you for think you. if? Like the three of us all co-authored a Minecraft like forty-page novel. If we could get it published, is that possible? Yes, that's absolutely. easy money. We could t- we should totally do that. Let's do it. Why it's, wouldn't we do that? It's do so it. easy. Like if if these guys can do it and go by like a like a, a pseudonym, then we could easily do it. Go by our real names. I'll put my real name on a Minecraft fanfic. I'll fiction. put my real name on Minecraft fanfiction. I'll do it. Let's do, let's seriously let's write a book together. Let's write a f- Minecraft fanfiction together and get it published. And the moment it's in Barnes and Noble, we do. A meet and greet and sign all the yeah, like sign a signing the at, the, at the Glendale Barnes and Noble. Do you think if we actually pushed it the best we could, we can make it a New York Times bestseller? Because it's apparently not hard to it's get. It's not a, difficult to be. If a we New can York make Times that a New York Times bestseller, that'll be like Our the Minecraft greatest fan fiction. The greatest accomplishment I'd have ever. Yeah, let's achieved. do it, dude. <laughs> Please, I'm serious. No, I love that. One hundred percent. One hundred percent. Like after we turn off the mics, we're legitimately writing this. Book. Yes. Well, yeah. Okay. You just write like like a like a forty page. You, and the people that get them bound, they're never in color, and they're from like. The cheapest little like Chinese printing company. <laughs> We're doing this. We're doing this. Let's do it. Can it be like he he meets the uh, like the pin pineapple apple pin guy gets crossed over into the Minecraft world? And yeah. To help him get out. That's so good. <laughs> and then in the end, they find out that it was just they had to make a pen pineapple apple. They have to pen. go in the crafting thing and put a pin in. We, we can't. We can't spoil the story for all Sorry, the. Well, yeah, yeah well, you got to read it to to find out. You'll what you'll happens. you'll find out probably what he's saying. A year we'll have. But it you out. can make like a, a million. About a year. Okay, like Stinky Steve has a bunch of books. The Hero Brian like saves school or shit. They make like twenty of those books. Yeah, I'm but, sure they make good money too. Yeah, but we'd only need one to make our to make our stamp to build a legacy. Yeah, our legacy. Make we'd our only stamp need. On we should at least make it a trilogy. Yeah, okay. Easy, yeah. Okay. Because that's that's just. That's just how it is. Should we make the last book in the trilogy like this <laughs> thousand page, like really well written novel? Not even any pictures. It's just like ten point font. <laughs> <laughs> you need a mic- magnifying glass to read it. Like it's a... <laughs> Henceforth, there needs to be a scene where like uh... the jokes on us. We spent like that would mean we spent years writing a book, and then like like thirty people buy it. <laughs> know. You know, in the Bible, when Jesus talks, it's in red. When Steve talks, it needs to be. That was red. when God talks, it's in red. <laughs> is it? Yeah, I think it's, it's God. It was the best of Brian's. It was the worst. Of Brian's. <laughs> That's how the Bible starts. Genesis one. It was the best of Brian's. It was the worst. Of- First time I ever met you, Aaron, was I came to the Game Grumps office and you came out uh, in a scooter and you rode your scooter around and you went back in the room. I don't even think I said hey. I was just like here and I was like, oh, damn. There's, there's Aaron and you go around a scooter and you went back. <laughs> that sounds like me. Um, it's not. A big deal. I'm, I'm working on it right now, but I accidentally forgot to censor your email uh, password in a video recently, and I took the video down, but um, I just want to let you know, I don't think anyone um, has uh, like gotten it or put it online or anything, but I'm, work, I'm working on it right now. Just Wait, so it. it was uploaded? Yeah, for a couple hours, but it's... A couple hours? <laughs> it, I don't think anyone... I'm on it. Don't worry. I'm working on it. It's fine. I don't think anyone's got getting, getting into your email. Well, Jesus Christ, I gotta fucking... It's fine. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm positive. Oh my God. I'm going, I'm searching the terms and everything on Google to make sure that... I get it, I get it, it's okay. I didn't mean to interrupt. Yeah, no, it's fine, it's fine. It's totally fine, though. 
I don't think a single person even noticed. I didn't, I didn't even see any comments about it, okay? Oh my god, I already have like new sent emails. Are you fucking kidding me? I have to change my password. Okay. Well, I'll just, just keep doing your thing. Hey. Uh, uh, real quick. Not a big deal. Someone, I just want to, it's just a formal heads up. Someone changed, they got, through your email, got into the Grumps YouTube channel and they changed the password. But I'm figuring it out right now. It's not a big, I know how to get it back. The Grumps email? I thought it was just no. my email. My personal email. Yeah, but that's linked to the Grumps account, so they were able to... But it's okay. It's just it's just the channel and the PayPal. And I'm uh, okay, it's it. just the channel and the PayPal. I'm just I got it under control. I know how to. I think I know how to get it back. The, the email address on the it's linked to the Google account, so it's yeah. They can get anything. It's not. A, I totally know how to get it back. Oh my god! I did, you don't even need to worry. It's just I was just giving you uh, just to let you know because you're, you're my boss. I don't understand what what is I'm taking care of it mean. That doesn't. I gotta go. Work. Totally cool. Somebody's got to take the fall for this. Okay. Hey. Last update. I contacted YouTube. They said we can. They could get a look back to us in about seven to ten business days about getting back into the account. So I think we're on the clear. Nothing to worry about anymore. Got under control. That's a really long time. Te Do you say 10 business days? Se seven to 10. And also I contacted Wells Fargo about the banking info that... Oh, we use, we use Bank of America. Why do you know that? We're, I think we're in the clear, just seven to 10 business days, just hold on and, and not even an issue. Mistakes happen in the workplace. Cool, thanks Matt, good work. Thanks. Am I still on board? What do you mean on board? At the company. Yeah, yeah. I'm not gonna fire you over this. I just want it figured out, and clearly nothing was figured out today. So it's, it's seven to ten business. Yeah. Think, wow. Yeah. That's yeah. Okay. That's gonna be resolved in, so right, well, quickly. I think you're doing a great job. I'm gonna take off and head head home. Then. Yes, please. Yeah. I'll, I'll take yeah. the rest of the day off. Thank you. See you. Yeah. I don't want anyone else in his position. I think he's. I think he's crushing this. Scratch my armpit. Can I scratch your armpit? Yeah, sure. It's gonna tickle. Actually, no, no, no. <laughs> hey, what? How did you not think that was gonna tickle? Is this let's play? Just gonna just develop it. Oh, <laughs> the tickle! Stop it, guys. You guys want to have a wait, tickle fight? As the screen, as the as the screen's just down. Wait, wait, wait. No, seriously. Who's the most ticklish here? Probably me. Okay, wait. Can I? Just to prove a point. Yeah. Okay, ready? <laughs> Stop. Ross, stop. stop. This is, okay, this is the, the most minute, homosexual the thing I've Ross, done on no. leg. Just Wait, no. stop. Okay, now, now do me. This is, yeah? this is the case. Oh, what's going on? Where are we going? Well, Ross is taking over. I'm just, I'm watching. I'm not, I'm just sitting here. Matt, you're editing this one. Okay. Okay, Whoa. we're back. Uh, welcome to Elsa's Jacuzzi Celebration with uh, the guy from that Christmas movie it's Christoph. Ross, Ross do you realize it's Christoph. Do you realize everyone's going to hate us because because they're going to think every time we come on the channel it's just going to devolve into us playing Frozen <laughs> Flash games. <laughs> it's like, "Oh, I'm not even going to click the video this time because it's going to be Frozen Flash games." Putting Play-Doh in her hair. It's conditioner, guys. You're so bad at vesting. You just under fucking stand. Damn, dude. If you, if you if you put conditioner in your hair and don't something? get it all out, your hair is going to be like slimy all day. What? I don't know, man. What's going on? Why is she saying mm-hmm? Because these are foods. Oh, what's See? happening? Is she eating them? Yes. What's the point of this game? If you're not over six feet, you should be ashamed of you. Aaron and Dan from Game wow. Grumps. Oh my God. You, you less handsome and less talented versions of us. <laughs> what is it? Were you reading the comments of the recent thing we uploaded together? Yes. No. Fuck. That's fucked up. That is kind of fucked up. Right? Did it really say that? Yeah, probably. You've been implicated in a scheme. Well, I'm sorry, but also this. You, you've, you've been implicated in a scheme of stealing dinos. Do you actually have our dinosaurs? Yeah. Mm, no. Not no. For real? No. Yeah. Why would yeah. I take the what good am I? What's good is gonna come from that to me? From... It'd be annoying to us, and you love that. Well, you clearly moved him off the table because you 
filmed something yesterday. Well, so what is the evidence that makes it right for you to interrupt our recording session? We're doing Let's Plays here, guys. This is like, how many episodes are we in at this five. point, Five. This is episode this five is, of Animal Crossing. Episode five. Look, we're an hour and 46 minutes into our recording session. Look, I know how dire it is to record Let's Plays. Oh, phone. do you? Yeah, no, we do. Okay. This, this engine runs on Let's Plays, Aaron. It's true. But we need our dinosaurs to start the other show that runs the engine. Yeah, we can't. We need it. This right. engine can't run unless this engine runs. You know, just Why as well as I. Tris trickery and misdirection. Just what? what you we don't have your. We don't have your. We don't fucking dinosaurs. Have your dinosaurs. Well, then what did you? What did you contribute? What is this clue? Give us the clue. What clue? clue. Tucker clearly told everyone to do something and say something, <laughs> and. Allie he didn't did tell us shit. He didn't. He we, we're forgotten. recording. We're recording Super Mega. Al Allie's being all weird, and Ike is hiding behind the shelf where all the video games are. That's his desk, though. And he, he, yeah, I guess that is his desk. He works back there. And he's got a blonde mustache that I never saw before, and it's weird in the light. He takes yeah. his shirt off a lot at work, too. I don't know if you guys have right? seen that. Is I don't. That it's right? weird. We just, someone should talk to him, but we don't have the dinosaurs. That could be cool. Yeah. But and and, and Ross was drawing cool. pictures of the dinosaurs. You, you guys have to be... You guys are in on... We got nothing Were to do we with actually, this. like... There's, I, I promise we actually have nothing. I know a lot of the office trickery does boil down did, to us, did but. Did Tucker actually tell you that we had? It, it, was, it was Allie that pointed us in this direction. What's going on, Allie? But why? Do you guys remember that social media picture I took of you yesterday? Yeah. Well, why? We're going to play some RuneScape. Got a little old school RuneScape. As per your <laughs> suggestion. <laughs> Re really excited about this one. Uh, I used to play a lot by myself when I was a young boy, and I thought it was called Run Escape. <laughs> <laughs> Are you serious? Yeah, because I'm like, you you run and escape from all the monsters. <laughs> that, was, act, that makes complete it was, sense. Makes, like, how that many... makes more sense than RuneScape. Yeah, right? Just a, run Escape. Just a scape full of runes. <laughs> this looks like my dad right now. <laughs> Put a comma, run, escape. <laughs> you can just skip the tutorial, go kill a bunch of cows for how three do you, hours. How do you skip the tutorial? You can't. You have to get through it. See? They want to make sure you enter the world of RuneScape knowing what you're doing. But you clearly know what you're doing. What the fuck? I'm you said you were an experienced player. Why is it forcing you I to do this I am an experienced shit? player, Aaron. Relax. Just how wait until I give the actual I am relaxed. You're the one who needs to relax. I burned my shrimp, damn it. What did you do? Throw it in the fire? I have a low cooking level, so sometimes it, I cook those perfectly. I burn these by accident, though. So you got to catch more shrimp now. Some experienced player you are. Aaron, come on, man. It's a brand new character. Mm -hmm. You're really giving my friend a hard time. Yeah. You know, Aaron, I could log into my old account, and I'm like level 60, and I could cook the shrimp perfectly Why don't every you do time. that? Why don't yeah, you do that? Yeah, why don't you? Why don't you show off? Well, you know what? Maybe I wanted to have a new adventure with my friends, and I, I didn't need to show off. Hey, Ryan! Aaron and Dan from Game wow. Grumps. What oh the God. fuck? You, you less handsome and less talented versions of us. <laughs> what is that? Were you reading the comments of the recent thing we uploaded together? Yes! No. Fuck! That's fucked up. That is kind of fucked up. Right? Did it really say that? Yeah. Probably. You've been yeah. implicated in a scheme of stealing dinos. Do you actually have our dinosaurs? Yeah. Mm, no? Not, no. For real now? Yeah. Why would I take the, what good am I, what's good is going to come from that to me. It would be annoying to us, and you love that. Well, you pr clearly moved him off the table because you filmed something yesterday. Well, so what is the evidence that makes it right for you to interrupt our recording session? We're doing Let's Plays here, guys. This is like, how many episodes are we in at this point? Five. This is episode this five is, of Animal Crossing. Episode five. Look, we're an hour and 46 minutes into our recording session. Look, I know how dire it is to record Let's Plays. On oh, do you? Yeah, no, we do, this okay? Engi this engine runs on Let's Plays, Aaron. It's true. But we need our dinosaurs to start the other show that runs the engine. Yeah, we can't. We need it. <sighs> Allie's being all weird, and Ike is hiding behind the shelf where all the video games are. That's his desk, though. And he, he, yeah, I guess that is his desk. He works back there. And he's got a blonde mustache that I never saw before, and it's weird in the light. He takes yeah. his shirt off a lot at work, too. I don't know if you've right? seen that. Is that right? It's weird. We someone should talk to him, but we don't have the dinosaurs. You guys remember that social media picture I took of you yesterday? Yeah. Well. Why? She the... asked, she said, hey, can I get you guys? Wait a second. Oh, my God. Tucker, get this. There's a... What? In the background, Vernon was in the, leaving the power hour room. And yeah. he's holding the... He's holding the pencils. Damn, Is I he know. holding the pencils? <laughs> that sneaky oh, fuck! Oh, he is, dude. What? All right, is Vernon in his hidey hole where he writes shit on his fucking hipster typewriter? I feel like those were used. Yeah. Like Us, too. Used? 
You go visit supermega.com slash. We don't own that domain name. Go to supermega official. official. Supermega will be. YouTube.com slash user slash supermega official. You don't have to put user. We actually just oh, got awesome. slash supermega official. That's, so. that's incredible. Matt and Ryan will be appearing in person at FurCon 2019, the furry convention. How dare Hemp, right? HempCon, <laughs> March 28th through March 27th. And there is a fantastic, fantastic convention for John Deere uh, riding lawnmowers that we will both be guests at in October. So hope to see you guys We're there. We're hosting a panel, two-hour panel. I'm yep, really stoked great. to see that one. Yeah, thanks, I'll man. be there, front row. DeerCon, we'll be there. Don't okay. joke about that. You will be there, right? Uh, yeah, um, I, Dan, uh, we, we only had I, so many guests I, this spot. I, I, so. Oh, man, look okay. at that. Oh, yeah, we we'll got talk about this later. Yeah, we, we don't have your dinosaur. Bur so far, I'm pretty sure anybody on this board could have done it. So me or Jory or Jory. Furry yeah, yeah or or guest director Furry Man. This is a waste uh, of time. Dog with gun. Resources. Yeah, it would be a waste of time according to you, Matt, because here's a picture of you clearly shoving something up your butt, which oh, could you be used that. The, okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, mean, didn't, I didn't say you could share that. Next picture, year, really. next year, Coney 2012 poster. This picture wasn't. <laughs> Meant to be shared, Allie, so thank you. Uh, you okay, have well, responded to me. You were gonna stick, you're sticking something up your booty. What is it? Though? Yeah, I don't know. could it, it be a, a dinosaur? No, it was a fake pistol I was shoving <laughs> up my ass as a prank, as I was pranking myself. It's right? a funny prank. Okay, yeah, that Did you steal the dinosaurs? No, yeah. I didn't. Okay, fine, I believe you. Was it Skyward Sword? You're gonna believe him just like that? They don't accuse me of a crime that I did not commit. How do we know that? <laughs> you were in the power hour room yesterday. Because he's a great kisser! <laughs> it's what I've been told. <laughs> Honestly, like I said, it's a waste of time. We're, we, we're, we should be making money, guys. Come on. You're a waste of time. We're trying to figure out where our heckin' dinosaurs you're are. It's so to... fucking mad. I'm looking out for the company. This is so stupid. It's I'm also stupid. gonna yell. I'm gonna start yelling too. Look at Ryan's face. Does he look happy right now? No. no but he, he never does. <laughs> all right. It's gonna be okay. Oh, gonna... you're all out of run escape energy. <laughs> It's called the game is always you're always escaping from your uh, your ability to run. It was dude, funny, right, guys? Dude, dude, I gotta Holy say, shit. I was laughing inside on the inside. In I'm glad, heart. man. Those are the laughs that count. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna go inside of this house, and then that'll <laughs> let me go through. Is that what you were saying, Ryan? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh. He's like when a comedian does stand up, <laughs> like nobody laughs. They're like they're laughing on the inside, and that's what really counts. <laughs> that's what counts man. Okay, here we go. It's like why don't those doors automatically open when I walk up to them? I don't know, dude. Why are you asking me? I didn't fucking make Run Escape. I'm gonna go back in time you're in really, 2006 and you're email really, Jagex. You're really pouring sour milk all over me for calling it Run Escape, But dude. that's what it's called. Now. Run Escape? That's can what we, it's called in my heart. Can we just bring it back? Run what? Escape? Run Escape? Can we title- It was never a thing. Title the video is Run Escape. <laughs> run Space Escape. <laughs> <laughs> like edit the logo so that like Run and Escape are like really hard. Dude, the logo is awesome but if like, you haven't seen it. Yeah. Do horrible stretching on the image so it's obvious that I was just- <laughs> <laughs> no, it's C, clearly. <laughs> the, the, the game designer was bad, not no. Like part of the E is like still next to the N. Dude, wh where do I go to start this quest? The, there's an arrow blinking on top yeah, of I the Yeah, watch, I talked to him. Yeah? Now you have the journal open, I'll tell you a bit about it. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, I, so I, I simply overlooked the last sentence where he said you may find some adventures in the caves under my house. <sighs> Guys, I'm really failing you on this. I'm sorry. I told you there was a dungeon, Matthew. Listen, I promise after we get off Tutorial Island, we're going to have a fucking Matt, killer you're, time. you're pulling a me right now. Aaron, no. People expect this kind of gameplay out of me, but not is, out of you, is Matt. Is the new Aaron? Hey, come on. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is he talking about? He said you're not ready to go down there yet. He's you're not. So you're not done listening to him. He has more things to say. I just talked to him. He's and got he a said... blinking yellow arrow. Make it go oh away. Oh, my God. Watch. Hold on. They should just play a sound effect. Just... <laughs> <laughs> so that you make sure to click it. Okay. You may find some adventure in the caves under my house. Cool. Yeah, moving on. It's time to... Oh, why did it just do it now? I clicked out of it earlier. Because now he's telling you to go down the ladder. I think maybe you clicked out of it instead of clicking continue. Oh, oh Matthew. I, I, I forgot. It's one click. It makes it's, me climb the ladder. And if he does portal. that again, you know... What, you Look, know what? there was another pink person. Sorry, go ahead. I was just saying you know what you have to do. What's that? I have to um, I have to grab his neck and, and wring it out like Bart Simpson? Please don't do if that. If you want. <laughs> 
<laughs> even though it's really dangerous and could cut off circulation to it's, his head. It's not dangerous to choke a kid. Killing cells rapidly. It really isn't that dangerous to choke a kid. That's kind of a common... Why is everyone thing. wearing pink down here? I think I'm in love with Randall, dude. I'm gonna have dreams tonight. <laughs> I'll have cream dreams about Randall. Man. Cream <laughs> dreams? I've never heard that before. Dude, let me get in the fucking rat cage. Holy shit. What, what's it telling me to do? You're holding your dagger. Yeah. Yes. You can unequip items by clicking on them. Can you can close this window this by clicking on the small X in the corner. Player. He just guys, skips through the dialogue. And because I, I, <laughs> it's not. I'm really good at RuneScape by itself. Oh, I get, I'm really good at RuneScape. <laughs> How do I get in the game? Hey guys, where do I go? <laughs> this icon's blinking. What do I do? I'm a fucking pro. I didn't see the icon blinking. <laughs> blinking. <laughs> You're making me slur up my words now. No, my words. I can't speak well. Okay. Don't make fun of me, Ryan. <laughs> Dude, you're not gonna be making fun of me when I have a fucking like mithril two-handed sword. God, I'd piss my pants if you pulled one out right now. Like, Stop like, making I, fun of me! <laughs> you're not gonna make fun of me once my character's level 60 and he's gonna have a mithril sword. Jeremy, sorry! <laughs> Why, you better watch out in three months. Yo, Ryan, I'm coming for you. What if he won me, bitch? Yo, man, you're talking a lot of shit. Get on RuneScape and let's see if he's still in the top shit, man. Dude, one v just one v one snipe me, dude. Can you guys do any good SpongeBob uh, impressions? <laughs> uh, sp oh, oh, someone here can. I, I know that. Oh, uh, let me. Uh, I don't know. Like, oh, you I, I don't know. What's 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 fucking Mr. Crab sound like? Uh, says pirate, right? right? He's like he goes. Arr, 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 arr. Chris, you I can, can do one. You, you can do a. Uh, you do plankton really well. Yeah. Oh. Okay, here goes. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> there he is. That's a plankton. SpongeBob or whatever. <laughs> he says, uh, the Krabby Patty secret <laughs> formula. Give us. A, 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 I want you right now to ad lib and make up the. What is the, the what is the formula, Chris? Right now, go in his voice. Go. What is the formula? Shit. They, 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 they say shit. it. <laughs> no, we'll just it's make it shit. up. Uh, <laughs> they say it. In, oh, fuck. I, mm, You're just, putting me on the spot. Make it up. Don't be a pussy bitch. Um. Uh, sugar, spice, <laughs> these shrimp are the, fried rice. <laughs> these are the ingredients chosen. <laughs> I like plankton. He's funny. He's pretty fucking funny, dude. F is for friends who do stuff together. U is for Uganda. <laughs> <laughs> Chris, can I request you to do some things in Plankton's voice yeah, after this? Sure. It doesn't have to be on camera. I just can we just do it on camera, please? <laughs> sure. Yeah, go for it. Uh, Just do it now. Why not? Chris. Mm. I, I can't fucking think of one now. I know. It's hard when okay. you're on the spot. That's why right? I said off camera, because I, I, I'll think of something funny later. Uh, Ross, give us something. Okay, how about this? Um, Plankton is selling uh, his new product at his store. It is... Oh, you're looking at me for this? Yes, what is it? What is his new store? What is his new store product, Matt? Bug spray for people in wheelchairs. <laughs> Ah, wait, okay, let me get. <laughs> uh, Grabby, I'm at my new store selling bug spray for Ugandans. <laughs> Is every Ugandan in a wheelchair? Every Ugandan's in a wheelchair. <laughs> oh my God. Has <laughs> ever draw dicks on dual dudes, or do you yeah, censor them? Yeah, we did. Last you gotta censor them. Yeah, we do it to annoy the shit out of Ryan. I'm sure. I'm sorry, Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, Ryan. Ryan, you want to be on Doodle Dudes? Yeah, Ryan, you want to come on? <laughs> <laughs> you do it better than anyone I've ever heard. <laughs> That's his laugh. Ryan's laugh is, is, is a, it's, it's so joyous. It, I know, it makes me happy. When it's I one of those laughs where when you hear it, it, it makes you, it warms your heart and makes you smile, <laughs> you know? It's just good. Mega podcast. That's us. That's them. That's uh, I'm joined with my guests Matt and Ryan. This uh, is this is this is the host Ross. Um, Ross. Thanks for joining Super us, Mega. Ross. You're Ross welcome. O'Donnell. Thanks for keeping just, my channel warm. Just kind of getting it started right away. <laughs> oh, wait, what? What? Matt, what are you doing? Mic back what do you mean you got to? You this roll is unprofessional. Back. Sorry, what? Are we talking about race? What's going on? What? <laughs> what are you, what, what are you what? talking? What? what, what? We're talking about fans coming up and saying catchphrases. Oh, sorry, I just zoned out because you're like, boring me. I no, what I'm saying is, <laughs> oh, fuck off. I'd rather have a legitimate conversation with someone who is a fan of my content. I love it when Ryan gets mad. What the fuck? He just goes, fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> or I like start shouting out a just a line of fucking curse words. Non-coherent insults. <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> fucking shit ass, stupid ass. 
bell bottom jeans, bitch. On the last <laughs> wait, the <laughs> on the last podcast, you called me a bell ringer, and on this <laughs> I called because well, like a low income person. <laughs> yeah, like I mean? a, it's like a bell ringer because like, then I also linked it to Quasimodo. <laughs> I'm calling him like a Quasimodo type Dude, person. Dude, if you like, imagine someone ringing a bell, they look like a fucking idiot. <laughs> Just a bell ring. Yeah, I think yeah. That, I think that's a good slang. You know when that's you go to a slang. counter and there's no one there, but there's a bell. No one wants to ring that fucking bell. You look like an idiot. I'm you like, look like an asshole, I thought. I think I just you I do feel look like, like an, an asshole. You look like an impatient asshole. Just wait. They're probably in the bathroom. Don't touch the bell. The only time I've ever touched the bell was um my dad works at a hotel just to get like his attention or like someone I know's attention, like a friend, like to fuck with him. But is your dad Mr. Mosby? <laughs> <laughs> is my dad a bald black man? <laughs> yes. No. He's not. I've met him. He is. I wish he was. Oh, that'd be I'm great. I'm kidding, if he dad. Was, I love great. you the way you are. White. <laughs> <laughs> I can't change that. What yeah, am I supposed to say? It's true. Uh, it's true. But do you, wait, is it racist of me to like be glad that my dad is white and like, oh man. <laughs> well, that's a good question because, because technically, hear me out. Okay. Hear me out first. You couldn't say, you wouldn't be white if your dad wasn't white unless you were adopted. So you saying that. Yeah, I guess it can't be racist. Wait, maybe. It's well, it's racist. well. I'm not saying it in the sense. I'm not saying it in the sense of boy. I'm glad my dad's white because I'm white and I'm better. I'm, sa saying, I'm saying. Are you I'm glad saying you're, thank you're God saying, my dad's white because yeah, that means he's my dad. That it's racist because you say I'm glad I'm white and not one of those other things. But I'm not saying that. What, but you what did. I, you just did. But leave a comment below. As, as, you, as an example, Ryan's Ross, racist. Oh, you're just gonna keep interrupting me, aren't you? Yeah. Just to get in the yeah. fucking spot to get me all riled up. Okay. I just wanna get you. Matt, you wanna you wanna interject an idea? Yeah. Dad, this conversation. I'm glad. I'm glad. You know. We're we're five minutes into I'm sorry, an over. over <laughs> I'm so just, anxious. Just hey Ross, it's all right. It's working. We, it's funny. We have 75 more minutes to fill, so okay, uh, let's cool. let's talk about more racism. Actually, we're talking about original ideas. Do you you know that whole game when you say a sentence that you you know has never been said before? Yep. You're the first person to ever say that sentence. Yeah. Give me one, Ryan. No one else has okay, ever said okay. this in the history of mankind. Boy, that hippo over there sure wants to be fucked by General Sam Worthington. <laughs> yeah, I mean, hmm. yeah. Sam Worthington's an actor, actually, isn't he? Isn't he the guy in the new Terminator? Like, he's the one that ever, like, he's just bland and people don't like him. This podcast is going to come out and someone's okay, going to just Google that. <laughs> okay. And it's going to find out, actually, there was a hippo that was <laughs> okay, fucked by Sam go. Worthington. <laughs> here we go. Yeah. Quokkas are the least favorite animal of everyone on planet Earth, and they're not cute. No they one's are ever cute. No that. one's ever no said one's that. Ever exactly. Said that. Yeah, okay. It's a lie. So no one's going to say that. Dude, this one time I went to uh, Taco Bell in the car, and Matt and Ryan and Chris were there. Yeah. And then we went to the, the drive-thru, and the, the guy said, what do you want? And I said, I'll have the naked chicken chup chalupa. And he said, sorry, we're out. You're really, you're really holding that one against him, it aren't you? It was really bad. I was, was really... that even an hour ago? Yeah, it was, it was like an hour and a half ago. ago. How, are you like, are you still sad from I that? I really are wanted you, one. Are you Did you really like it? It was good. It was okay. All right, let me get it's my spicy as fuck. Yeah, it well, was. Let Matt give his big opinion. Well, his me, expert food opinion. Let me get my expert Aww. fast food critique opinion. Mm -hmm. I had the naked chicken chalupa a few weeks back, oh, which what it is is it's a piece of fucking like it's like a fried chicken. Holy shit! That's the shell. The, the shell is fried chicken, and oh, that the inside's a taco. Yeah, it's really trust spicy. America to come up with that one. I Boys. know. <laughs> oh, God. I like the way you described it, Ross. You said it's like the perfect um, personification of depression. Yes. Yeah. Just like a chicken shell taco. Yeah, it's like, wow, I'm depressed. Nothing's going to pull me out of it. Even, so I might even as well just this, fucking eat this. Yeah, I might as well just eat this. It was really spicy. Mm -hmm. yeah. Really spicy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. it's, it was, yeah, because, I mean, we're not, me and Matt don't have any spice tolerance. and I don't either. Do you? Either. Really? You don't ah. either? You've seen, you've seen my, my eyes tear up. Yeah, I have. Mostly because you're crying like a bitch. And he's a little crybaby bitch. Yeah, I am. I do bitch. cry a lot. Yeah, that's all right. I understand. Okay. You, got, you got a lot to cry about. Anyway, yeah. Matt. Um, if Ryan just broke down, like, no. <laughs> Guys, uh, we're like by the end of this podcast, we bully Ryan into submission. <laughs> Ryan's just over here, just like he stops talking, just like yeah. And then by the end, like we look over and there's just like a little tear in his eye. He's like, what? And then I just well, as I'm leaving the room, I'm like, do you guys want to hang out? And then you're like, yeah. I was like, I just met Matt. <laughs> oh yeah. I, I have to go take care of Lego anyway. I'll I'll just save the audio. <laughs> I'll just go pet my dog. <laughs> I'll just go DP the audio while you guys go. Have go fun. DP my dog. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Oh, really what? Okay. You guys feeling this one? Yeah, I, you know, I think I like it. I I like it too. Yeah, let's let's do it. One of you yeah, guys want to do this? I like, I like numbers. One? I like wheels. <laughs> I like women, <laughs> right? What? We all like women. No, Girls. Man. No, that's fucked up. Dude, Ryan, give me a high five for sex with women, dude. Emails. Dude, nice, you guys. <laughs> dude, did you know Ryan and I have sex with women? No way. Yeah. Dude, 
Yeah. What, what, All right. True story. Oh, wait, I need a nunchuck. What the? Oh, shit, dude. Shit, do we have a nunchuck? There's a nunchuck right on the floor over there, dude. Nice. I can see your, all your underwear, dude. Dude, D's nunchucks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ha-ha. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Well, guys, welcome to the episode where the controller no longer works. Uh, do we even have more batteries in the office? I have no idea. Do they? I, I, I remember recently scavenging for batteries, and they didn't do have any. Do you film our battery adventure? Let's go get some batteries, I guess. Um, let me whip out the, uh, the old cell phone. Hold on. Justin, I'm about to start filming. Justin, I'm filming, see? Um, there. There you go. Uh, so, we got batteries not working, so let's go find let's them. Let's get some batteries. Okay. Jory, our what? controller's dead right when we start the episode. Oh my god, that's awful. What are you guys trying to play? Batteries? No, I mean, we're trying to play Animal Crossing. We're looking for batteries, though. Oh, oh for a wafer? Yeah. Oh, fuck. I need double A's. Look at all these fucking boxes. Jesus Christ! Batteries should be back there, but there's boxes in the way. Oh, this is weird, guys. By the way, this is, uh, Aaron actually jerks off to this. Get back there, boy. Oh, sorry. We could steal them from, uh, one of Aaron's electric bongs. No, he took all those. <laughs> Oh yeah, Brent definitely has some in his vibrator. Brent, uh, you know that massive vibrator you have? We need to use the batteries out of it. No, but it's in me right now. What? No, Help us find it. batteries, Ike. Yeah, but he was inside. Nobody knows where the freaking. Well, they're covered by boxes. Don't hurt me. Sorry. Where are they? Ryan, Ryan. Wait, wait, Ryan, stay next to him. Ike. Matt and Ryan from Super. Are those double A's? Oh, they're right here, dude. They are. Thank you, Ike. Put two of them right here. Thank you. Mmm, batteries. Okay. Okay. Bye. Thank you. Look at that boy go. I'm glad he started wearing his shirt around the office again. It's on. It's working. Oh, check that shit out. Look at that. Yeah. Wait. Hold on. Ooh, why don't we play like this? Yeah, let's let's record the whole thing from out here. Oh, you're talking to Pee-wee. Oh. Uh, pipe down. Well, it's Borat. I might have known. What's with you? You haven't come around at all, you mad bro? Oh, yeah, we haven't played in a couple weeks because uh, we've been in Japan. So, uh, uh um, what's up? what's up? Just say what's up. I feel like we should go back in the room. Yeah, we should go. This well, my controller died. That's not Did sick, it? yeah. You have to get other batteries? What the f Man. I'm, 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 I'm teed off. It's time for a wacky battery break. Wah! Battery break time, motherfucker. Okay. You remember where Ike showed us where they were last time? Over uh, there somewhere. I think they're over there. Let's go get some batteries for the controller. It's only been a couple episodes and the battery's already died. Okay. Just do so much gaming. Were they- Stupid! Ow, I'm barefoot, brother. I miss you. I miss you. We're gonna come back. Nope, it's still not working. The battery's still... Nothing, baby, nothing. Come on. Oh! Oh, okay. Sweet. Hell yeah. We should go see what... Before we get started. Ready, here's mine. Whoa, yours is really good. He says, that Wow, was... what this do, giant? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> I don't think I have to censor that no, one. No, you at don't. All. It's it's I didn't ever say what it was. Show me yours, Riney. Okay. Riney vagina. <laughs> 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 Whoa. Did you fell like that? Chair. <laughs> like I tried my best. <laughs> oh my god! Yeah. It's fucking could you, could awesome. you guys tell me each one thing I could have done better? Um, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> you could have made his collar a little smaller. <laughs> his collar's like 
fucking wings. <laughs> you look like fucking dad wings. Come on, Ross. You got anything? Give him some critique, you um, asshole. Uh, uh, probably a little bit more construction. Uh, <laughs> hands are generally the same size as the human, as the person's face. Uh, he got that right. He got that right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. Yeah. Um. Otherwise, I think it's a masterpiece. Okay, thanks. I did. I didn't do anything crazy or creative. I just drew him. <laughs> oh, I love that. I love yeah. this. I love this fucking finger. <laughs> Look like dried up earthworms. Uh, I like the giant. <laughs> <laughs> he looks like he just wants the his fucking little fingers just want to grab onto the little screws the giant leads behind. Mine. That's him after hanging out with the giant for too long and irradiated a little bit. <laughs> Here's mine. It's not that great, but um, fuck. Sorry. Yeah. Fuck. Uh, it's, it's Iron Giant and Hogarth sucking on his finger. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> that good. Iron smells good. <laughs> you suck. Here's mine. <laughs> Is it Vin Diesel? <laughs> Vin Diesel isn't black. <laughs> I mean, I just thought. Well, then why is he black? Because I didn't know how. To, uh, you want to know why? Because I didn't know how to draw the fucking body. Because the body seemed too complicated. So I just like tank tops are easy. Made him a guy. <laughs> then I gave him muscles. You're right. Uh, mine is the oh. scene in the movie where H Hogarth dies. <laughs> <laughs> he, no. he falls to the ground at like enormous velocity. It's such it's bullshit. like a plane crash. I know. Oh, I Hogarth is fucking dust. Oh. He doesn't even have a bumper or scratch on him. <laughs> <laughs> There you oh, go, Ryan. Oh, Ooh. Naruto run. Dude, oh. nice ninja run. <laughs> <laughs> that is the Naruto run. I like it. Dude, I bet all her friends love her. <laughs> she did doesn't you, embarrass anybody. Do you guys ever know any kids that were really into anime, like in middle school and high school, that would actually run like that? Yeah, I look in the mirror. <laughs> <laughs> did you did you wait, did you actually run like that? Of course I Naruto run. Are you kidding me? It doesn't make you like go through faster the, though. Through the high school hallways? No, well, maybe. <laughs> no, I no. might have. <laughs> That's the real reason he left high school. I guess. You I, <laughs> I fucking uh you never seen that picture of me with the swords? And I've shit? seen that picture. I love it. Oh my lord. Me to a T. You know, Ryan, I was Yo, Yoshi, you gotta move too. Oh yep. Um I was steaming with rage when you really messed that last game up. But uh, you know, I'm not so mad anymore. We should get some coins too, man. Well, I'm trying to get some coins too. <laughs> so would you get off my back? Sorry. <laughs> You sound like my dang dad. <laughs> well, if things go right, I might. Never mind. It's fine. I don't no, want to say get it, Ryan. Say, no, why don't you go ahead and say what no, you No, me and your say. mother are rather okay. close as two human beings. That's yeah, all I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I know. You took her out to dinner last time you were this in This isn't town. a sex and joke. I'm just saying she's a good friend of mine. I know, and, and he took her to Olive Garden, and I didn't think that was a very nice restaurant choice. Yes, they have in the We're really steamrolling this one. I had sex with your mom. Sorry about that. Yeah, well, Dan, guess what? I had sex with my mom, too, so. So who's laughing now? done that. Ain't no big thing. Yeah, so I bet you feel weird knowing that we're tunnel buddies now, huh? I bet you feel like a real weird creep it's now. It's like a binding between father and son that no father and son has ever had before. Yeah, I actually... I can't say that. Oedipus Oedipus had that. Well, Oedipus is a lucky son of a bitch. Yeah, well, Jeez, I had sex yeah. with your dad, so... Mm -hmm. Oh! Uh, that makes two of us, yeah. You jealous? I also had sex with your dad, thereby making us oh, shit, wiener sorry. cousins. Hey, wiener cousins! <laughs> hey, look, it's Between Grumps, where it's a CRT TV. <laughs> we're inside the TV. Wow, that's some real inside baseball right now. Yeah. Is it done yet? It's done. Yeah. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Tucker, get in here. What are you doing? Stop filming people that aren't. No. Would Tucker. you stop? It's not a vape commercial. I'm, uh, we're just kind of really desperate for subscribers right now. We're at like an all time low with our YouTube channel and we just really. Stop filming him. I don't want him stop. to be filmed. Stop it. Stop. I don't want to be on camera. Matt, what the fuck are you doing? Why are you on Reddit? Get off Reddit and start working! I'm sorry. Jesus, you have it open over here and you're not even working on it. I'm sorry. I can tell you haven't worked on it because this bar isn't moving at all! Yeah, I'm sorry. Introducing the new Dan. Which can which which camera am I looking at? That one or that one? Neither of them are on. Is it is are, is either one rolling? This is just for us. This is just for us? Yeah, it's just a fun sure. So I can I can say some really bad shit then. Yeah, please. It, especially if it's racial. Alright. Well if that's the case. There's a tiny fruit fly and it's driving me insane. Do you want to kill it? I don't want to kill it. Why? Because it's, I mean, it's not hurting anybody. That's mine. It's hurting the What shock. do you mean that's yours? Did you make it? No, I brought it in. Why? That's your pet fruit fly? Yeah. 
Do you walk it? Yeah. I think I might have unplugged the thing that I wasn't supposed to unplug. You know what? I don't even have to unplug things. I can just plug everything in. Ow! Sorry. I'm in Vietnam. You're coming with us, son. Last chopper out of Vietnam, baby. Come on. What? You okay? You right? <laughs> Kiss me. What the hell are you doing over there? I'm testing the new Guitar Hero. How you doing? How's the song coming? I'm gaming right now. Okay. <laughs> Edit fucking Guitar Hero in the background, Tucker! <laughs> Do I have to explain the bit to you? Yo, yo, can I get a hit? <laughs> Fuck that shit. That's right. <gasps> Holy fuck! Drug use is funny! <laughs> <laughs> Look, Matthew, <laughs> things have been getting really heated between us. I just feel like it could be something. Why don't you come work on my dad's peanut farm? Well, Lena, well, your dad's peanut farm? I do mean it. A job for me? Oh, I've been working at the, the farm all seven hours a day, drinking peanuts. I tell you what. There's a little something here between us. <laughs> I think there's something more than peanut farming here. I'll tell you what, when I have sex on a girl, she's always screaming for more. Same here, bro. Up top. Yo, guys, I got money in the bank. You see this? 25 gold, uh, glems. Gold. Dude, you put it in Litecoin. I put it in Dogecoin, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna deposit my burnt shrimp in the bank. Isn't the value of Dogecoin like, like, $0.001 or something like that? Actually, Aaron, if you've been reading correct websites, you'd see that it's through the roof right now and the Dogecoin market has never been stronger. I don't think said, so. You should have said through the rough. <laughs> Just saying. Mini coin, much high, man. It's huge. <laughs> All right, I talked to my bank I my wonder, bank person. I wonder. <laughs> Did I ever tell you about my pump and dump scheme? <laughs> the pump and dump? <laughs> yeah. What is this? Is, that, is this like a business you're starting? A pump and dump is like you, so you pump a bunch of money into like a stock, into like a shitty small stock, um, and then you tell people like that it's 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 on the up and up. So you so you pump money into it, which increases the value of it, right? So people start like pumping their money into it, and then you just dump it out uh, and like get all your money back. Oh, with damn. with the increase that other people went in because they thought it was a rising stock, <laughs> and they're all fucked. Yeah, I'm talking to a fucking financial advisor right now. He's gonna tell me about the <laughs> yeah, value me. Of I'm telling you about pump and dumps. <laughs> this is you, man. But so my my, <laughs> I, I was like, man, wouldn't it be fucking cruel to do a pump and dump scheme with Dogecoin <laughs> and just be like, we're only accepting payments of of Game Grumps merch in Dogecoin, and then <laughs> and then just like pump a bunch of money into Dogecoin <laughs> and then people have to buy it to buy Game Grumps merch and then just dump it out. Holy <laughs> shit, that's genius. <laughs> well, it's, it's illegal. <laughs> yeah, I don't know about that, man. They're, they're, willing, they're willingly putting their money into Dogecoin. Yeah, but you're, you're, you're lying about the value of it to like, I don't know. Aaron, this is semantics. It's, it's fucked up is what it is. If it's not illegal, <laughs> it's fucked up, so. I think we can get a lawyer and I, I think he can probably hilarious. argue a pretty good case on why that's perfectly legal. <laughs> I just we, we told we told our, our our fan base to put their money into this and they did. What's wrong with that? <laughs> no, I wanted to kill it, not milk it. I got milk now. Well, now kill it. <laughs> oh, I can't I can't kill this one. I can steal the cowbell though. So you're just gonna milk me dry then kill me. <laughs> you need to have started. Fine, the cold do war it. <laughs> yeah, like like this this cow with the super strong <laughs> chin. Just if it's for the others, <laughs> just please look away. He's looking at the other cows. Yeah. The sun's setting. It's like cow baby is like crying, like no father. Don't like, watch. Don't worry. I just want to kill. It'll some be cows. quick. Then you like botch it, and he's like ah. He's just like, ah. <laughs> he's just like ah. <laughs> 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 And like all the cows are like, oh my god! It's like, it's just like a horrible fucking sound and sight. You can just picture people grimacing once that bit started. Yeah. Just like their headphones just vibrating on their heads. Just God, no, no! He's actually got a very broad chest. Oh, wow. Sorry, I just had to scream it to the heavens. I've, I've felt that way. 
Sometimes I scream into the heavens because Minecraft's not real. It fucking sh- hurts. One day, babe, we'll be in Minecraft. <laughs> no, like, if humanity keeps progressing, there will come a time when Minecraft will be pretty much real. <laughs> what, VR? Or no, like- just like, they'll figure out a way to make it real. Did you ever think cavemen back in the day would be able to picture an iPhone? Like, there's <laughs> stuff that humans won't be able to, you know, they, they can't think about right now because it's too advanced. It's too triggering. They'll be able to send people into Minecraft in the future. Matt, didn't you screenshot that picture I sent you of uh, Roblox? Which one? When I was crying. <laughs> yeah, I have it. Do you have that? Yeah. Can I see it? Right now? Yeah. Yeah, let me, hold on a second. Can you put it up on the episode or just? I can put it in the episode. Uh, I want to see if it's funny still. <laughs> fucking love this picture. <laughs> the old man in the purple pants pissing on himself. I want to see. It's a good picture. Ross, look at this picture. It's an old man in purple pants, and he's wearing like a little glittery shirt, and he's <laughs> he's, he's got his dick slightly out of his pants, and he's pissing all over himself. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's sitting on an old couch. I fucking love that. Where'd you find? Did you send me that? I, I for, who sent me that? Where did you get that? I forget. It made me laugh really hard. Hey, Ross. Mm. Fuck! Don't say that on Doodle Dudes. You can't say that. Ah, Here it is. Ah. When, you re- when you realize Roblox can never be IRL. <laughs> You're <a> Ross, look. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Not nah, send me a virus and hack me, dude. <laughs> send me a virus and hack me? <laughs> dude, yeah. Send me the notch virus where your little face comes up on my screen and says, Ha! You're hacked. <laughs> Got you. <laughs> and you replace all my EXEs with Minecraft. And he goes, yep, that's my game. Dude, it, <laughs> the virus fucking, uh, you know what it would do? It would turn all the brown bricks in Minecraft into uh, into diamond b- blocks. Have you seen that, that fucking uh, that prank people do? No. They go into someone's texture files, and then they fucking replace every single uh, texture of brown, like the brown dirt. Or like I think copper or or no it's 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 the fucking coal and they turn the coal all into diamond the diamond texture so people freak out thinking they keep finding diamond but it's actually just it's just coal. dirt it's just dirt and coal yeah <laughs> so fucking mean those are some wacky antics well they're just random <laughs> oh you won't see them okay yeah, that is so it, yeah. random holds up spork <laughs> dude <laughs> I shouldn't have done that I don't know why I did that Matt that's so raven I was dude. just pressing buttons Ryan why that, did was, you, that was a terrible that idea was I was just pressing awful. buttons I died of why that. did you do that's Ryan. awful here we go are you serious what a <laughs> terrible idea <laughs> just what an ass backwards idea. What were you thinking? Hold a big old number for me. There we go. trying to change the subject. I got a five. Are you happy? Yeah. Let's see what you get. Nice. Good. Fuck yeah. Dude, that was a sweet roll. That'll get see, you like can... nowhere close to the star. <laughs> Ryan, you, you just royally fucked us, dude. Back to the editing bay. We're still in the CRT TV. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, they've haunted my television. <sighs> okay. Right. Take my hand. Okay, there Ready? we go. Uh, oh, come on. Wait. Yes. Oh, it's a double. Yeah. Oh, it worked. Nice. I mean, fuck you guys. We've actually uh. won games before by giving each other like friendship energy. Like, <laughs> it actually has worked. Like, I can't remember times. the specific episodes. <laughs> like on our channel, I'll be like, Ryan, I'm giving you all my friendship energy and it works and he wins. Like, I think that happened. Cool. I think it happened in Cuphead. Yes, once. Cuphead. I, I gave you all of my, my, my friendship energy and then you defeated Mr. Cuphead. Nice, dude. You well, I'm, I hope you guys work on them. Work uh, on them? Yeah. yeah, we are working on it. Oh, <laughs> I thought you said wore a condom. I, yeah, I, I, I did. Oh, I, okay. I thought you said work on them. Oh, and I well, was like, who? Who are they working on? No, I hope you guys wore a condom. Jokes on you, Aaron, because I'm always wearing a condom. I'm confused. You never know when sex might strike. Just in case. <laughs> Whoa! Did sex you just hit stroke. the mic? Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, that's a nine. Wait, did you not hold my? <sighs> you still got a nine. It's fine. No, you didn't use friendship energy, <gasps> and that's why you landed on the. The oh, friendship shit. energy carry. You landed over. on the curse. Oh. Ah! <laughs> now that was some French <laughs> energy. It is. They do have a gangbang. Like that's like a very that's, infamous that wasn't a part bit of the they book. were doing. Why, no, that's why? an infamous part of the book. What's up with Stephen we're, King? Why is he? Why is he writing that? Stephen King. <laughs> wait, wait. Are you are you really like confused about that? Stephen King's known for like all this really? weird sexual shit. Like he's a I've pervert. I've never read a Stephen really? King novel. Yeah. I didn't know that. I mean, he's, I've read Carrie. He uh he uh he's he's a very big pervert, especially apparently like back then because. I don't know if this was like a. Apparently, he like did a bunch of coke. Stephen King. Yeah. That doesn't. <laughs> wow. No way. <laughs> I didn't like. I don't know that much about Stephen King. All I know is that he's a pervert and did coke and writes a bunch wow. of books. Wow. Well, now I don't feel so bad that I think he looks like a ventriloquist dummy. <laughs> <laughs> he does. He does. He totally does. He's got like the lines that go down. Like Jeff Dunham could have his hand up his ass. <laughs> 
What do you think I'll Jeff Dunham's jokes would be with the Stephen King puppet? <laughs> I don't even know, man. <laughs> you ever, you ever, you ever seen an underage gangbang? <laughs> I think of it all the time. You just the made book is silent. I'm not saying anything about dentists. I'm just saying every dentist I've run into, their voice, it's like very calming. But the, it's, it's like what I imagine a pedophile would sound like. <laughs> it's like dentists and pedophiles have the same type of tone. Now, I'm not saying all dentists are pedophiles. <laughs> It's just like, have you taken care of your teeth? Yeah. Oh, well, it's man, probably those, those teeth look really good. It's probably because it's good. like a grown man up in your face, up close to you. That's probably why it feels like it's like a soft yeah, man's just voice trying to be up gentle. close to you. Yeah. I can feel them breathing on me sometimes. Even through their mask, you can feel like the warmness of their breath. And they're saying all that <laughs> dentist bullshit that's like labial, bipolar. <laughs> have you seen that? Uh, have you seen the... Uh, uh, Louis, have you seen the show? Yes, that's uh, I was the thinking dentist. About that, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, I have. Yeah, such a good show. So, I love Just that put, show. Put so the much. banana in your mouth. Go on. <laughs> so, like in that scene, in that oh, world, like the go. dentist did put his dick inside yeah. of Louis's yeah. mouth one hundred percent. I love that. <laughs> like, I love that the guys like. Like Louis wakes up and the guy's just in a rush. Like, <laughs> yeah, good. You're good. <laughs> yeah, oh, no, no, that's great. That's Isn't great. in Seinfeld? Isn't there a moment in Seinfeld where the dentist like fucks on top of him? What? Yeah. I don't know. Brian Cranston's the dentist and he fucks on top of Jerry while he's unconscious of the dentist. I thought that was, I didn't make that up. I right? thought that was in something else. If that's in Seinfeld, that would be interesting. I swear that's in Seinfeld. Maybe it was in like. Sign fuck, like the Seinfeld parody, <laughs> porn parody. Exist? I'm, I'm glad that that would be the name, yeah. just sign fuck. Yeah, they just don't want to get creative. <laughs> but then in parentheses it says a Seinfeld parody. Yeah. <laughs> just in case you didn't know. These pretzels are making me thirsty. <laughs> Better suck this dick. <laughs> Squeeze the cum out of it. Those are some big breasts. <laughs> I've never seen such big breasts. Elaine, your breasts and nipples are very large. <laughs> What's the deal with your nipples? <laughs> you can tell they didn't cast me correctly because I'm circumcised. <laughs> hey, Jerry. <laughs> Starts Kramer. <coming>. Kramer. <laughs> Kramer. <laughs> Kramer. <laughs> Kramer. <laughs> George loses his virginity in front of all of them. Uh, this is every episode of Seinfeld, all right? This is, uh, this is every episode of Seinfeld, right? Here, I've never here, here seen an episode of Seinfeld. You've never seen great, Seinfeld? Dude. No. All right, here's, Seinfeld. Here's, here's every episode of Seinfeld, and you can quote me on this, and you can watch, and you'll be like, he was totally right. Okay. Here's every episode of Seinfeld, all right? Seinfeld's like in his house or whatever, and then and then George comes in, he's like, Jerry! Jerry! He smig bobbed me. He smig bobbed me. And he's like, what? What? What did he smig bob you? He smig bob. What did he? What did he smig bob? He smig bob me. I don't know. I don't know. What's a smig bob? And then Elaine comes in and she's like, and, and she's like, hey guys, what's it going? He's like, he smig bobbed me. He's like, oh well, you can't get smig bobbed. You don't want to get smig bobbed. <laughs> but he smig bobbed me. Jerry, like, what are you talking what about? He did. He smig bobbed. That's a bad thing. You don't want to get smig bobbed. That's not a big deal to get smig bobbed. It is a big deal to get smig bobbed. <laughs> and then Kramer comes in and he's like, hey. Jerry. And then they're, and they're like, oh, I got smig bob, Kramer. And he's like, oh, you don't want to get smig bob. And he's like, I told you you don't want to get smig bob. It's not a big deal. Whatever. Let's just, look, I'll go out and get smig bob right now. And then we get smig bob. <laughs> <laughs> That's every episode of Seinfeld. I've never heard a more accurate representation of an episode of Seinfeld. Holy shit. Have you practiced that? No. That's, that is to a T, that's Seinfeld. Is every, that is it. That is every episode of Seinfeld. So go watch Seinfeld and you'll be like, oh, that's fucking. All you need is right. like a sound. All I will picture are like is just you dubbing over everything that they're saying. <laughs> Mix in some establishing shots of like a New York high rise with a bass line. Hey, Smig Bob, me! <laughs> Jerry! <laughs> well, you don't want to get Smig Bobbed. <laughs> you know, I like saying I'm from Wisconsin because. Cause, well, that's where all the cheese is made. And in my house, if you cut the cheese, <laughs> you're the funny man. I don't care where you are, that's funny. I don't care where you're from. That's funny. I want to go to a There's little fat boys throwing their bras on stage. <laughs> <laughs> Just fucking scream like the woman in the background of a uh, roller coaster of love. <laughs> <laughs> I want to fucking go to a Larry the Camel Guy show and just. <laughs> <laughs> Every time he tells a joke. <laughs> Just bring like an open cup of something and then just fucking shake it around. Like and it's like a, everyone. Like I'm on a can of baked beans. Just <laughs> <laughs> Vectrex was the first on screen drawing tablet. Yeah, I knew that. 
Isn't that fucking crazy? Yeah, that's crazy. It's like 79 that, or like, something. Isn't there like a tutorial video of like an old man? Uh, oh yeah, Mr. Wizard. Yeah, Mr. Wizard. Yeah. yeah, and he's like showing how to use it. So check this I've seen now that. if you press it to the screen. It's horrible, but it's amazing that it's like you can touch the screen and it draws. That's something else, man. I mean, <laughs> come on. <laughs> does anybody else remember? <laughs> does, does anybody else remember <laughs> DS chat? Picto chat. When, Picto pick, chat. Pick the chat. When, Fuck, dude. Do you remember <laughs> when you used to scribble in the, with the pen on the chat thing all the way, so it'd be just a just a just black, a rect, yes. just a black rectangle. Do you remember? And they use the eraser to draw. Yeah. You use the eraser to do it. It's like a negative image. <laughs> That's good. A negative what? A negative image. Ooh. Larry the cable guy be like, out of that Picto chat. <laughs> <laughs> now, now my my children. Are so plugged in the technology. When we're at the dinner table, not say pass us all, they pass the TV remote. <laughs> so, Larry, that's not even a joke. <laughs> but like the crowd is going wild. Woo! Oh, my kid do that too. My kid do that. <laughs> I take a moment out of the when you when you mow the lawn. And and it, and and the grass is too large that you can't see your own dog. Would, would you? How do you explain that to your kid? You know what Ryan did? Some really mean did people I, I met. One day on Twitter, Ryan just said, "Hey, go tweet at Matt H. Watson your favorite Doctor Who memes." <laughs> oh yeah, I got, like, that was when like we had this is. Was this before we started Super Mega? Oh yeah, this is much before. We started Super <laughs> I Mega. just was like, go tweet them, and like people would send them their like legitimate like like this I, makes me laugh. Dude, I think like eighty five. Right no, Ross, do not do that right <laughs> now. Let's, Ross, see, let's see some are, funny memes. Ross, for the love of God, do not do that right now, please. But we have to pick a different thing than Doctor Who, Ross. What should it be? Guys, Steve, I can. I can, Steven Universe. No, Steven no, no, Universe. No, 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 no. Send your favorite Steven Universe Please, memes to because Matt H. Watson. I got a Doctor Who meme as recently as like a couple months ago. Still. Please send. Wait, really? Your you still get Doctor Who memes from that shit? Yes, like a couple months ago, Steven I got one, universe. and I was try I was like, why am I getting this? to- Oh, okay, that's why. <laughs> send your favorite Matt. Doctor Who memes. You know what we do to Barry? Sometimes we'll just be like, hey guys, go tweet your favorite picture. We did of it like Sulfur once at Barry. Okay. <laughs> Please send your Ross. Please your favorite Steven Universe movies to. Uh, um, Ross, thanks. Um, do you, okay, if it's not Steven Universe, then what do you want? I don't want any tweets. Okay, well, me. too late. Then it's already sent. <laughs> oh my Steven God, Ross. Universe. I just got a memes. notification on my phone. I haven't Let's seen see. Steven please Universe. Send People your say favorite Steven U Universe memes to Matt Watson. Thanks. Ross, you piece of shit. <laughs> I'm gonna favorite that right away. You have like right 440,000 followers. <laughs> that has a large reach. When <laughs> Ryan did it, he had like 50,000. You have like, want um. You have uh, more followers than that, so. <laughs> oh God, it's getting likes and retweets. Let me go check. Let me go check my notifications. Oh, Ryan McGee liked the tweet. I did. Look at that. Let me. Uh, hold on. Wait, are you filtering out fans, Matt? No, I'm not filtering do you out not, fans. Do you not like the fans? No, I just have to change my notifications. The audio so wasn't on. Matt said that he thought uh, Super Mega fans were terrible. I did not say that. And then I told him that he's not the Matt of Super Mega, and then I took his job. You young people watching, they don't want to know about taxes and accountants. They want to. They want them to t tell them a funny joke about Mario right now. All right, I got one for you. Okay, so let's do it. Mario walks into a dang bar. But he's in Minecraft. Wait, okay. now go. Wait, is Sonic there? Is Sonic, okay. Sonic the Hedgehog Mario walks has got to be Minecraft there. Minecraft bar. Okay, there's a Minecraft okay. bar. Mario <laughs> walks into a Minecraft Son bar. Sonic's behind the bar. So so Sonic's, the, Sonic's the bartender. Okay. Sonic's the bartender. Yes. And Mario goes, I'll have one gin and tonic, please. <laughs> and Sonic goes, coming right up, Senor Mario. <laughs> Dude! Yeah, right? And so he pours him a gin and tonic. And yeah. Mario goes, hold on. On the rocks. So he makes it on the rocks. <laughs> and he gives it to Mario. <laughs> And and Mario says he takes a step and goes, "What is this?" <laughs> <laughs> is that it? That's the punchline. Keep, keep going. What dude. is this? <laughs> keep going. And then, and then right before Mario takes a sip, <laughs> Hero Brian walks in. Shit! Yeah, no goes, fucking way. Hero Brian walks in. He doesn't even exist in the real game. Did you know that? Uh, are you serious? Yeah. No, he's in the patch notes. He's, okay. in the, he's in the patch notes? So wait, hold on. Are you on. sure? Yeah. Is this canon? Mm -hmm. Sorry, Matt, continue. Hero, I, I was Hero very Brian, enthralled. Hero Brian sits down next to Mario. Okay. And he <laughs> goes, I'll have what he's having. And then steam comes out of his ears. <laughs> Mario goes, give me a bowl of circus peanuts. <laughs> I'm dying. I'm dying. And 
gets on, he goes, right away, sir. And he gets some big bowl of circus peanuts. And Mario takes, a, he eats one of the circus peanuts and goes, Hi, caramba, I forgot I'm allergic to these suckers. <laughs> Bandicoot, and he had Matt's, all seven Matt's Chaos Emeralds. Dead. I'm dying, dude. Oh. I didn't even get to finish my joke. <laughs> I thought that was that was a good joke, though. No, 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 no. Um, the end. The the joke ends with uh, Mario mm-hmm. has an allergic reaction. Yeah, and the 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 pediatrics. He gets smaller, and then he's too young to drink. Okay. Yeah, that's it. And then he gets arrested for underage drinking. Yeah, that's because the joke. he gets smaller. <laughs> all right, guys, animate oh. that one. Yeah, <laughs> I can see that. <laughs> Just like, it's like got clips of the fucking shit happening, and then just like long pauses of, of us on the couch trying to think of what happens next. Ryan, you're laughing. Right? <laughs> that that's like one of my favorite moments ever. Yeah, was all that laughing. That <laughs> laughing you, was you, insane. All I have to do is do a do a big old fake laugh, and I get Matt laughing. There, there's nothing that'll make me laugh quicker. <laughs> I, your laugh is like it's like you're, you're, fucking it's like gold. I want to mine. I want to want to make sure you know that wasn't an actual laugh though, Ross. It still made me laugh. Okay, which good. made it genuine. Aw, I'm I'm thank you. It's a I mean no no no. It was a real laugh, Matt. I'm sorry. There is a loss in my chassis. There's a loss in my chassis. There's a loss. There's a wasp in in my, my chassis. Chassis. <sighs> Bessie. Fuck. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm dressed. Okay, it's we're done. We got two points. Ladies. A-C-E-F-G-H-I-J-K-L-M-N-O-Q-R-S-U-E-W-X-Y-Z. Would you still love your head look like this? Oh, that's really nice. I'm really happy to hear you too. Family portrait. Dude, nice. Landing on random spots that don't do anything. Mm. Fucking dope. Aaron, why don't you shut your trap? I'm going to. Oh, what is that? That's an ally phone. You need allies. Wait, I can just call an ally and be like, I want you, baby. Yep. Okay. <laughs> it's random, though. So whoever picks up. That's so random. <laughs> That's so random. It's the few. Wait, that's so random was an iCarly bit, wasn't Holds it? Holds up fork and says XD. See, that was random. <laughs> what items no do we have? Bacon. Uh, we got the key, which this I'm about to sparkling. use. Okay. Opens the door. Peas. Cool. Just oh yeah, go for it. Full of peas. That's random. That's late epic random. Let's and be random for the rest of the episode, guys. All right, <laughs> waffles. God damn it. <laughs> Waffles, don't you that mean carrots? Me. Dude. <laughs> Waffles, don't you mean carrots? <laughs> Remember that? Dude, that's <laughs> random. Thanks, man. Yeah, man. Who be Hi, be random, be random. random. <laughs> Sloths! Three toed! <laughs> Dude. <laughs> um Zebras with spots. <laughs> oh, oh. Random. Did you know oh. in Mississippi, Fuck. if you shoot a deer, what? It's illegal to eat with a spoon. <laughs> 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 I love Dan. Dickens. Can you try being random for a second? What is happening? Yeah, right dude, now? we got it. We're, we're all being random over here. Oh, okay. Can you can you try to be Bean. random? Sure. <laughs> nice cotton candy pants, Dan. <laughs> <laughs> Last uh, time I saw those carrots, I ended up in Banana Town. <laughs> <laughs> Muffin farmer. <laughs> yeah. oh. I don't care for oh. Jews. It because it's ran. Everybody uh, ready? Uh, yep. <laughs> Let's play. Dude, All right, Dan, you gotta go. Oh wait, I, f- I forgot to look at. I was too busy being <laughs> anti-Semitic. <laughs> to... You were being really random. Yeah. You suck, Dan. Thanks, guys. Shut up. Okay. I hope you get it. <laughs> I love you. I'm so sorry. I love you too, brother. <laughs> it's, it's it's for the bit, Dan. Oh yeah, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> but was it real? <laughs> but was it real? You like we walk out, you're just like fuck that. Was it actually for the bit, you guys? <laughs> <laughs> That's like when you make a bit with Jory, and it's like a rude oh joke. Afterwards, he'll come on and be like, mm-hmm. "Hey, I just want to let you know, like that was just a bit." <laughs> oh like, my god, Jory, I know. <laughs> don't, they didn't notice, so don't worry. Okay. Just don't don't make You're... a scene or anything. What do you? Don't make a scene. Th- no! <laughs> come on, guys! What the fuck? 
<laughs> what? Fuck off! No, I didn't do anything. Fuck your shit, Aaron. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> oh my god. I'm Why are you being so I'm weird? This fucking <laughs> company. Why are you being so weird right now? We worked hard for those stars. Yeah, well, I worked hard trying to steal it, okay? <laughs> Thank you. God. That was the most insane. Nobody scream. likes a feet. My bike got stolen this week. You reminded me of the person who stole my fucking bike. All right, right well, now. I'm sorry. That's your problem, though. What? Well, look at it the way you play the game. Maybe you stole my fucking bike. Oh, maybe I did. How about that? Oh, just fuck you, Dan. Cool, let's get a star. <laughs> I'm putting you down in the police report. <laughs> he looked tall and stupid, and he had a dumb streak in his hair. <laughs> and he's my boss named Aaron Hansen. <laughs> But more so than my boss, I thought he was my friend. <laughs> and I think that's what's most disappointing. So, uh... Go for it. Okay. See you, buddy. Oh, shit. Yeah, I forgot they had that. Oh, dude, we're fucked. You're, you're done. You're done for. Oh, I don't think we can handle Big this. buddy. Uh -oh. Alright, roll, you fucking bad man. Okay, buddy number two, I got my dice. Are you ready? Buddy number two? Yeah, because I'm buddy number one. Ah. Oh, I thought you had two buddies, no. and he was like the least, the lesser of the buddies. <laughs> well, that is true. Just but... some friend that I have that's not in the room. <laughs> Check it out, I got one. I got three. I'm gonna call buddy number one tonight and not invite you. You need an odd number. You got it. Yes. Oh, mm. shit. My fucking man, Ryan <clears throat> McGee. There you go. Oh, well, well, maybe oh, not. Oh, 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 there you oh, go. Oh, Ryan, yeah. my fucking sweet Swedish man. Dude. I'm brother, bro. What? You're not Swedish. Yeah, he is. What? He bro fists me all the time. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. I'm in a terrible, terrible mess. It's the Duke's birthday day and I should be making him a lovely big birthday cake. I've forgotten to buy the ingredients. I'll never get them in time now. He'll sack me. What will I do? I have four children and a goat to look after. That's what he calls his wife. Would you help me, please? I have four child goats and a full grown goat. <laughs> Four, four, I have four half man, half goat children. I didn't fuck a goat though. I'm serious. <laughs> right. No matter what you see on those drone cameras, I did not fuck that goat. <laughs> I did this thing that my brother used to do, oh. where uh, like the teacher would be saying something, and it would be like complete silence, and then I would just go, "That's awesome." <laughs> oh my God. They always would just like turn around and they'd be like, "Okay." Anyway, <laughs> I want that one teacher to be like, yes, it is awesome. Aaron, stay after class. We have a lot to talk about. They never about. knew it was me, though, because I would do like a little, I would do, throw a little stank on it. But like, throw a little stank on it. Throw a little stank like, on that shit. It would just be like, so now when we take the three, we have to carry it over to the five because the, the decimal point is actually over two places. That's awesome. <laughs> okay, well. <laughs> If I was that teacher, man, I would have been like, which fucking smart-ass kid is doing this, man? I'm so done with this. I know, I know. Like, thinking back to it now, I'm like, what a fucking obnoxious kid. You know, one time the weatherman came into our classroom and did a presentation. Dude, and I, same. I unplugged the computer he was on. Really? Why? Did I was an was asshole you? when I was a kid. No, I got in huge trouble. Like, the class was gathered around a computer and he was showing them something. And I climbed under the desk and I unplugged that shit. Was this in, like, <laughs> was this, like, senior year of high school? <laughs> I love how you're saying it too with like the same vitriol you had when you when you just like had yeah, that I fucking nerd that shit fucking uh uh Charleston weatherman <laughs> that is such a weatherman name. hey I made it up to him though because then when I worked it at Chick Fil A in high school you he didn't he, 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 <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, was in high school I sucked the weatherman's cock hey remember that time though <laughs> remember that time I unplugged your computer yeah, no I already know what you're gonna do <laughs> I'm so <laughs> Guy gives a killer reach around. Holy shit, dude! He's gonna he's gonna like email me and be like, I don't I don't know you, I, but I I heard that on this popular internet show you name dropped me, and then you talked to, that you sucked my dick when you were a high schooler. <laughs> Should probably beep his name. Out. What if he starts to like? What if what if he like publicly is like, okay, he doesn't deny like the allegation. <laughs> <laughs> He's just it, like leads to this whole investigation. <laughs> yeah. And it comes out that like some fucking kid at your school actually did suck <laughs> <laughs> All because a joke made on Game Girls. <laughs> 
dude, he was the nicest dude, and I felt so bad for him because he'd come in, and I'd be like, refill Then why'd you unplug his computer if he was nice? Because I was a dickish kid, dude. And why? why'd you still say it with the vitriol that you had at the same It was funny when I, I did it. that shit. It was funny when I unplugged his fucking computer. <laughs> was it a laptop? No, it was a fucking, like, big-ass Dell. So is he giving, like, a presentation? He's like, now, kids, this is how you he avoid lightning so strikes. Something about like, the weather, <laughs> man. And I was like, talk about a little lightning, and I unplugged it. That's not what I, I wish I'd done. That would have been badass. Oh, yeah, the timing of it. Yeah, I think I just unplugged it because I was like, what happens if I just kind of wiggle it? Will it will it happen? And then it happened. And then I, I just remember my teacher so, so mad at me. She sat me down in a chair. Wait, so she knew immediately it was you? Yeah, dude. Were you like, I, were you, like I was crawling under the, I was over under the, the desk? desk. Yeah. <laughs> they were like, wait a second. They look under the desk and you're like, <laughs> <laughs> I have like the cable in my mouth. Dude, check it out. Thanks. Your purple is lovely. Think, well, are we slash super wow. mega? No, we're slash super mega official. Yeah. We are the official super mega. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, guys. Dude, I think he's hitting on you. Oh, shit, dude. You should start flirting with him. Wait, I think there's a way to like type special like colored text that waves up and down and shit. Who Mr. is this? Mr. Job. Mr. Job. <laughs> you have to put Thank in like you. the, um, can you have to put in those teach things. a lad a cantrip? <laughs> what the fuck is a cantrip? Teach him. What if, what if he trip? tripped you and he was like, haha, you can trip? <laughs> I like it. Dude, he's got purple shorts too, just you, like us. Got it. Dude, let him court you. Looks like a frat boy. <laughs> we got, it's acting like one. <laughs> Can't thou teach a lad a cantrip? Be, Be spoke, spoke to me. To me. <laughs> it's a fucking NPC. What the f That's not an NPC, is it? No, it has a, you can get a job. No, from that's him. a person. That's Are you Mr. Sure? Job. Yeah, level three. Mr. Yeah, see, Job. I can follow and trade. That's a person. Bespoke to me. <clears throat> All right, say, uh, to ask it, to say his shorts are. LOL, sorry, I'm high. <laughs> 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 Yo, give me some of your, your good cush, dude. High on what? <laughs> <laughs> I swear to God, if he says fucking life, Christ. <laughs> Jesus, yeah. High on on old school RuneScape, man. <laughs> I'm high on these graphics, dude. Oh, winky a little winky face. face. Are you a girl? Yes. Yes. I love. I love penis. <laughs> <laughs> Want to go explore? Let's go exploring with something. Oh, you should have put a winky face at the end of that, so it has a double meaning. I did. There it is. Okay. Whew. Hell yeah. Oh my god, if we fucking cyber with this guy on the fucking show, I, I am new. I am new. Oh, teach him the ropes, dude. Show him the- please go easy. Oh! Oh, damn! Oh my god! Oh, shit! <laughs> Yo, this guy is fucking hot to trot, dude. Oh, he's gotta follow me. He's horny as fuck, ready for some- <laughs> for, ready for some pink loving. Dude, look at the fucking Can outfit we Please help me. He's like, oh, please make your clothes skin color. I will. Oh, what god. will you give in my return? My fire alarm is going off. <laughs> I think he's gonna be standing there for like five <laughs> Dude, there's a his, your... friend, his friends are tearing him away from the PC. He's like, no! <laughs> no! I just no. met the love of my life on RuneScape! <laughs> he's like spitting and foaming at the mouth. Please! Like, she was gonna show me! What if he's high and, and he was so high that he put his pipe down and it burned his house down? <laughs> and that's... Wait, sorry, sorry, I left, I left my, my menorah, menorah burning. burning. The fuck? <laughs> this fucking guy is what? a trip, dude. The All right, is he following me? Yeah. Okay. All right, let's go on an adventure, guys. I want to. I want to give the viewers like a grand tour of 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 RuneScape. It's a Jewish. <laughs> so wait, can any two turns wait, left? The stars there. Why was I going this way? I don't. Because know. you're a loser. Oh, oh I my. The and you'll never do anything. Oh, Thirty-seven yeah? to the star. Well, uh... <laughs> <laughs> I'll have you know, Aaron, Ryan used to edit for Game Grumps. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> I did not know that, genuinely. As of 10 minutes from now, he used to edit for Game Grumps. Uh, Can't tell if it's a diss on them, it's fine. I'll use my dick block. Or my <laughs> my dice cock. <laughs> Dude! <laughs> You're on a roll, buddy. Call me butter, because I'm on a roll. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going bananas, man. Uh, don't slip. Dan. What's up? I'm proud that you're, like, really doing well. Proud to be But, there. like, it's making me clinically depressed. Oh, no. That yeah. was really fast. So, uh, if you could just 
decline this for me, for <laughs> Dan, my mental health. Dan, he needs this, please. I can't go home today with a, telling my mom that I lost this game. <laughs> She will not make him stake him. You'll be like, Mom, I'm sorry. I lost Mario Party. And she's like, not looking out for the paper. Like, that's nice. <laughs> <laughs> and What's I never got over it. Was Mario Party? <laughs> Can y'all suck a dick? We're, we're, there's no way we're losing. Yeah. Oh, yeah, shit. There's no way we're losing. <laughs> <laughs> there's no way we're losing. That's I, you. That's I, what I you sound like. I didn't say that. He said it. Ryan, why'd you say that? I didn't say that. Obviously, Obviously we have different voices. Stop. Matt, do what you need to do. Obviously, we have different voices. Stop. You have a stiff upper lip and a stiff lower lip. Who does? When you talk, it's like banging wood together. Does it matter me? M both of you. What? Yeah. What the hell, bro? Yeah, you both sound like this when you talk and your lips smack together. Okay, I'm done. Because they're both stiff. I have a palsy, Aaron. That's not funny. What the fuck? Have you ever noticed I talk out of my side, uh, out of one side of my mouth more than the other? Yes. That's because I have a palsy and you're going to make fun of it? Do you really? Yes, and I'm very offended. Do you? Oh, I'm sorry. Yes. I talk out of one side of my mouth, but I that just... means you. That means you're a freak. No, <laughs> <laughs> I just kind of do it. it. Doesn't really mean anything. Uh, no, Dan, you talk out of your ass. You oh, line, but only one side. <laughs> <laughs> only one side of my just one cheek. <laughs> what if you could speak out of your ass? Uh, Dave's like venture. That's my Ryan. hypothetical yeah. for the day, ladies and gentlemen. Wasn't it funny? Yes. Ryan, sweetheart, oh, yeah. don't put your mouth on the microphone. There's it's a, not on the mouth. There's a ton of disease on there. No, I've he put it before. <laughs> He's put it deep. I put it in my mouth before. <laughs> oh god. In the yeah. podcast, he just like good to know. I, I like to know what it sounds like. I'm like, what would it sound like? So I just do it. All right, fair enough. That's I fun. like to know what it sounds like is what Matt says every time he looks at his toothbrush. <laughs> <laughs> Slide that thing all the way down. <laughs> you give him a typewriter and he'll just write. <laughs> There's that there's that like thing that's like if you if you give monkeys <coughs> typewriters like yep. eventually they'll that's, write like yeah what I was referencing what what is the what what's that theory it's like they'll eventually write all of Shakespeare's work yeah, or something but I'm pretty sure the monkeys will die before then what is that theory like because I feel like I'm leaving something out wait, maybe it's saying wait, wait, that wait, we wait, are the whoa. monkeys and that over time we evolved into beings and then the end result was the complete works of Shakespeare. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let I me. I think I've cracked the Da Vinci Code, guys. I got, I gotta look this up, man. Let me see. Okay, monkeys. Ugh. Typewriter. Okay, monkeys. It throws me off because it's one of the only words that ends with Y, but when you make it plural, it's not I E S. It's just Y S. You know. Yeah. The I E S form is just a bunch of monks. It's like funkies. <laughs> Here it is. The inf mm. the the infinite monkey theorem. It has a Wikipedia page. The infinite monkey theorem states that a monkey hitting keys at random on a typewriter keyboard for an infinite amount of time will almost surely type a given text, such as the complete works of William Shakespeare. So it's just saying, like, if a monkey clicks keys enough, it will eventually type, eventually. That's like, that's like saying any stupid animal. That's like... But it would be a complete accident. There'd be like 17 chihuahua. trillion versions of, <clears throat> you know, almost Shakespeare. Like, yeah, yeah. To be all. They on fuck up the last sentence. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know. Oh, shit. We're so close. New monkeys, guys. Imagine having to like, like your, your hell is you have to sit in a room with a monkey with a typewriter yeah. until he types all of uh, like a Midsummer's Night Dream. Well, that's never going to happen. Have you just been writing God damn it, Ross, on this fucking timesheet? No, a monkey did that with a typewriter. Fuck off. <laughs> hey, if you give a monkey a typewriter, eventually he'll type God damn it, Ross. It's just it's just fact. If According to the info... <laughs> oh God, put your fucking foot in my face. I had my eyes shut because I was taking a long blink. <laughs> I felt your foot press against my face. You deserved it, son. I was taking a nice long blink. You, you ever poked do the bear with the stick. I'm sorry, Ross. And now you got the bear's horns. <laughs> <laughs> that's with the bear you get the horns <laughs> i love that saying dude didn't you say that but but didn't you just say that they were people that could turn into animals i said in world of warcraft yeah i'm talking about those things yeah like it's, it, like, like fake like, druids not real druids well you didn't specify i was specifying i said specifically the there's people, a study of real animals and people like holly knows stuff but about i'm fake saying things. i'm saying yeah because she found world of warcraft 
Well, and the tree people, tree people, you're only a tree person in World of Warcraft if you, you spec what are they in a called? resto. What are they called? Restoration druid. Are there, so they are druids. They're fake druids yeah, that but exist oh, in the world. Not all druids like, could do it in World of Warcraft. Medieval shit. I mean, they could, but they I'm not talking useful. about real old people who think they can do magic in the, in a, in the Celtic religion. Hashtag well, you were confusing because you were saying, like, oh, like, it couldn't be, it's not a real thing. And I'm like, but it I is wasn't, a real That thing. wasn't a diss. I found it interesting that people can study and know a lot about creatures that don't and never wow, this did is exist. a fucking stellar conversation. Maybe you should have my wife on because she could actually talk about this in great detail because she has a fucking medieval history degree. I'd love to have your wife on, Ross. Well, call her because she she when I was leaving, she said, I'd like to go on their podcast. And I was like, yeah, I bet you would. We'd love to have her on our podcast. Why, isn't, why hasn't she many been? Times. Because you won't let her on the podcast, Ross. I will. Every time, every time she tries my... to come in the room, you punch her in the face. Look, yeah, she she, she shouldn't be and here. Say, it's a man's out. world. <laughs> this is a man. This, okay. this is a man's world. <laughs> <laughs> built by men for men. This recording room. Hey, is I'm built man. By... I'm, <laughs> I'm not so man. We are the man. Am I in? Am I, am I in frame? It's Blazupa Hey from YouTube. Super Megan. That's, that's good stuff, man. Thanks, man. That's good stuff. <laughs> We've only been working hard trying to build up our own. No, it's fine. Yeah, on a technicality where you're both half wrong. Instead, I am going to give Super Mega one half point and Game Rooms also one half what point. What the fuck? That's, 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 that's not right. No, we've already got the ready. That's I not right. Somebody say That's not right. Ours was more right. I agree with Allie. Can I get a haircut? Wow. Wow. <laughs> oh my god, can we get the camera back there? <laughs> oh my god. This was a That's bad a loose idea. pie. I got no pie on me. Thanks, man. You did a really good job. Okay. I if mean, your spouse are... could have unlimited access to any store, which would it be? Oh. oh. See, Ryan, the fact that I can't actually think of an answer right now is no, troubling. Well, the only thing that I can possibly think of. Uh huh. Is Amazon.com. Anime Jungle! And now, Matt, what do you think it might be? <laughs> Possibly. Matt? Would it be, Ryan? 7 Eleven? Ah! <laughs> Amazon? What store? the fuck? Ryan, are you my soulmate? I never even thought of online stores. I just thought of stop. You shop. All right, three, two, one. one. There it is. There oh. it is. Sorry, 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 nice. sorry, sorry, sorry. I hate this. All right, I hate it. Could you at least clean me up afterwards? <laughs> you look like Frosty the Snowman. Oh, thanks. I really. <laughs> I was really attracted to Frosty the Snowman when I was like six. Say the name of the person, okay? Okay, ready? Three, two, one, Matt. Matt. Yeah! <laughs> Matt, we you constantly eat more junk food. We constantly talk about how much yeah, shit you eat and how bad you feel every morning. We talk about the every morning you. you come in. I have a headache. My stomach hurts. I eat like shit. You Why do the same. Say? Oh my! We do the exact same, and we always talk about you drink. You go over to a block of cheese and smoke a cigarette and drink a glass of milk. Let's get that pie ready. But. <laughs> Shit sucks, man. I'm sorry. We'll get tight on this one. Oh, uh, Ryan. It was Ryan's turn. Because Matt got the last one. Buddy, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. By yourself, bro. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Ryan. Hey, Ryan. I can see you now. <laughs> Yeah. Right, Y'all don't sound too excited to be playing this fun, fun game. Oh, I'm having a, I'm having a blast. A ball? Jesus. Having a good time. You gotta be fucking kidding me. I am so fucking epic. Aaron, listen, man. Yeah. Well, go ahead. <laughs> Lay upon me your wisdom. I was just gonna say you win some, you lose some, but that's just life, and I'll still be your friend no matter what. It's easy for you to say as the winner. Mm. You know, man, if you're, if you're gonna be a, if you're gonna be a big fucking crybaby over this, <laughs> what you want me to edit it so you guys won? <laughs> <laughs> oh, cool! We win! And just, just everything goes to static. <laughs> <laughs> just a close-up shot of your face. Dean's playing Minecraft. <laughs>
Oh, oh come on! Oh my god! Oh my god! You're the only fucking kidding me, dude! Oh! oh. Unbelievable! Fuck this fuck! <laughs> it's so annoying. Grumpo has the last brown you guys need to complete your color set. What did you just say? We have the last brown oh, they need. okay. Oh. The one that I thought we were... Uh... <laughs> We're back. Oh, I'm I'm so I've, I've, got, I've got with me got my- Fozzie Bear here? I've got with- <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> I've got a funny joke. Okay, Fozzie, what is it? Here's a joke about RuneScape. Okay, Fozzie. <laughs> When's the last time that you played RuneScape? I don't know, Fozzie, when? Just now! <laughs> oh, Fozzie Bear. Waka, waka, waka! Sound like my cousin. Hey, Fozzie, can you get the fuck out of here and go get Aaron? What? Uh, yeah, I guess so, but can I join? No, you're really fucking annoying, Fozzie. <laughs> wow, just come out and say it, huh? <laughs> waka, waka, waka! I agree with him, man. Yeah. Get Aaron, please. All right. Yeah, I'll do that. <laughs> but, uh, Fozzie, you know. cut the shit. Come on, get Aaron. Yeah, but we'll chat afterwards. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We'll sure, text man. you. We'll text yeah, you. Yeah, well, just, just text him. Hey, guys. That guy's fucking annoying. Hey guys. Hey. hey. What's up, Aaron? Hey, what's up? Dude, welcome back, buddy. Uh, here with, um, the boys from Super Mega. It's not the name of our channel, but okay. Ryan. Mi That's yeah, almost my whole name. Yeah, it is. No, it's not. Super Mega. It's not Super. I'm gonna ch I'm gonna legally change my name to Ryan Mega. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I he stopped me dead in my tracks. He spellbound me. <laughs> Sorry, I was, bro. I was I was like, wait, did I say it wrong? <laughs> it's like I'm I'm in a bit of a daze right now. Wait, but, did, uh, I, did I did I make you believe for a split second it wasn't actually called Super Mega? Yeah, well, I like second guess myself. I was like, what did I say? What did I say? Because <laughs> sometimes that happens to me. I'll be like talking to Susie and she's like, you mean this? And I'm like, what? And it's just like you said, you said f f fart bean or something. I'm like, oh. Well, I meant owl. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, you know, I did. I had limited interaction with Daniel because uh, as as he was like coming into our, as all you guys were coming yeah. into our lives, um, it was when he died. But like, I, one of the few conversations we had was about a band called Failure. Um, they had an album called Fantastic Planet in like 1996, and I was like. Dude, you like that album? And he's he said, I love it. And it's one of those albums where if someone likes that album, I'm like, yeah, they're cool. You know, they get it. Yeah, there's 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 some kind of kinship I feel with people that like certain albums, and yeah. that's one of them. Um, and uh, yeah, he he. Uh, so that 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 was impressive. I would have liked to have talked to him more about he's music. Just an overall very fucking talented guy. Oh yeah, yeah. He was like the most talented dude I'd ever met, for sure. Um, and and I, I guess not to get too personal, but I guess it was just such a weird experience for me, just because I, what a lot of people don't realize is I literally knew Daniel for eight or nine months. That yeah. was it. Right. That was it. Right. We've been friends online for a while, but like you were talking on Facebook a little bit. For like he a year or so. the thing is, Daniel introduced me to you. Yeah, that's how we met. It was um, through Daniel. I knew Daniel wow. before I knew Ryan. Yeah. That's uh, some shit. Yeah. So. Um, yeah, I mean that it, it was just I guess that it was just a it's looking back it's just such a blur. Not a it's blur, a, not it's like a, it's just a it's an interesting point in my life because it was so impactful. So much shit was happening. Looking though. back, it was such that whole era when all that shit went down and mm -hmm. I knew Daniel, such a small part of my life. Yeah. You know? But it yeah. it was such a big part of my life too. Yeah. Cuz yeah. that's the thing is different cuz like I've cuz I was with You were them. best friends for Ever for years and years and years. Yeah, I mean, we knew each other since junior year of high school. Oh yeah. He he was uh, yeah. I think senior year. He's one of my history classes, and he just drew this realistic picture of George W. Bush, <laughs> and I turned around. He was just like sketching it by looking at it because he was bored. I was like, I just shit like that. Yeah. Like I go back and I'm like, ah, that's a that's a moment. That, yeah. It's like ah, it gets me. And it's interesting how it's like just funny. Yeah, because uh, I mean, the truth is, the people that have huge impacts in your life are not necessarily always the people who are in your life the longest. Yeah. You know, I've had relationships that lasted a year that were far more impactful on my life than ones that lasted three years. You know, mm -hmm. um, it, it, it's, it's, it's strange that way. Like it, time does not equal, um, relevance or importance. Uh, but I, I, you know, obviously it goes without saying that I wish he'd stuck around because yeah, how great, absolutely. how great would it have been like if he was part of this whole crew we've assembled now, you know? You're fantastic. Yeah. I, I feel like 
I feel like he would add so much. And I'm serious, the most frustrating thing about this game is how quickly your running meter runs out. <laughs> like, watch, just watch. Like, it takes fucking forever to fill up, and I'm just trying to get somewhere. I just hear excuses, man. It's not an excuse. It's a legitimate thing about the. G <coughs> <laughs> Killing him, dude. I'm dying. Let's go on. Go I'm easy on him. I'm dying. What the fuck? <laughs> <That's> so <laughs> Fucking back burner for a while. Well, jeez, guys. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> I came to play some RuneScape with my friends, not get fucking like shit. I dropped my coins on the ground. I tried to take them out of the bank and I dropped them on the ground. I got my coins. <laughs> no, I'm having a crisis right now. Somebody took them. <laughs> I tried to take my coins out of the bank. <laughs> you took your money. And I out dropped of the them on the ground and someone them took them. them. <laughs> They're gone! <laughs> My god! I can't fucking handle you. What did dude. I do? <laughs> How did someone take them that quickly? You gotta fucking shout out to the world like, WHO STOLE MY COINS? Like, all caps. You can't do all caps in the chat, by Which the way. Which one of you sick bastards stole my gold? You can't type swear. Watch, if I type all caps, which- Hold on, I can't type- Which one of you fucks <laughs> stole my coins? Comes out like this. <laughs> 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 they fucking bail, dude. They don't care. Jesus Christ, dude. Okay, well, I'm gonna at least I'm gonna at least like, you can you can admit that you stole them. And like, what are you gonna do? Yeah, like I can't get them back. Like, it was me. See ya. Okay, I'm gonna at least put my my uncut sapphire in there because if I die in the oh, wilderness, God. you're gonna drop it on the ground. Destroyed my throat from laughing so hard at that fucking coin shit. All right, it's like the funny shit. Where did it go? Happened. Where is it? What? I just put it in. Put what? Oh. In? Okay. Oh, Matt. There's my coins. I scrolled down. I didn't mean to. I didn't know. How, that's so confusing. How, I, how do I know that I scrolled down? Now, how do you feel, Aaron? All your joy was a fucking lie. Yeah, thanks, Matt. Aaron, I'm sorry, man. Yeah, I... Well, it's fine. No, it's, it's fine. Just use your 25 coins to do something fucking useful and not attack 30 rats over and over again. The <laughs> only thing I have in the bag is friendship for my friend Aaron. Yeah, I know, because I give it to you constantly. <laughs> Everyone knows this is all a ruse, and I actually have a lot of love and respect for you, regardless of the outcome. No, Aaron's actually mad, and he's gonna fire me now. Yeah, it's true. But post that on the wiki. <laughs> <laughs> Matt was fired shortly after winning the Monopoly. <laughs> I, can't, I can't. That's the event. That's the, that's the thing. In a, in, a, in, a, in a tweet, Aaron said the events were unrelated. <laughs> <laughs> what was called the Monopoly event? <laughs> Shortly after recording a Let's Play of Monopoly with Matt and Ryan from the YouTube channel Super Mega, things went awry. Oh boy. <laughs> Our luck's turning around, Daniel for Daniel. <clears throat> well, like Daniel Vagina. Okay. <laughs> Daniel uh, Vagina. <laughs> Matt. Daniel <I'm> Vagina. <laughs> <laughs> I really prefer Mr. Business. <laughs> I'd really, Business. I'd really be that rather be the name. Well, Dan, that there's time for this. work and there's time for play. You got a name for both. Happens, I hadn't thought of that. Work hard, lose two. Fuck hard. Yes. Uh, <clears throat> now you're like, work hard, fuck hard. <laughs> I don't know how that happened because we were getting smoked for a long time. Uh, getting smoked like a fat joint of marijuana. It's the fucking luck of the draw, Aww. dude. Luck of the draw. Oh, like yeah. fuck of the draw. Dude, that was funny. <laughs> Let's let's just let's just stop the show. Let's and stop let's for just a second. Everyone, hold up. That was funny. That was some funny shit. Leave a comment if that was fun. There was a a, a a large woman there, with tribal facial tattoos. Her whole face, tribal facial tattoos. That's dope. And then she was like, I forgot my glasses. Yeah, could she was press, trying to get like ice. Could you or press something? three minutes? No, she was like, could you press three minutes on this microwave so I could heat up my breakfast? She's but she's like, she I don't have my glasses. Please <laughs> help someone help me. She was covered in tribal tattoos, like, but not like the cool kind. It did not look good. Last Whoa. last time I saw her, she blew a snot rocket out of her nose. Out. Really? Yeah. That seems to fit like what <laughs> you look at her once and you're like, oh, okay. So that that fits with like what I saw. Whenever that happens, I'm like, oh man, because like it's like. You, you'd think it's like, oh, this is the type of person to blow a snot rocket out. But I wanted to like be surprised when she walks out and like fucking plays cello like a champ or something. But <laughs> no, she just, she's got those snot rockets and she went to like breakfast. That's, that's so true. <laughs> you see somebody doing something like competent that's like above like an average level of competence. You're like, oh, okay, I trust this person. <laughs> and, but when she walks out with her like 
tribal tattoos and then just blows like a massive snot rocket <laughs> well, out of her Well, the thing nose. was, it didn't come out the first time. It was one of those where it was like... <laughs> Why would you do that when there's people like around? It took that one final one. And then <laughs> I've right never... Out. I don't think I've ever even blown one. I, I don't, feels good. I don't I mean, have the like strength. I've only ever done it in the shower. I don't have the strength. Like my my, I don't have the nasal strength to like projectile something. I think you could. I think you're just nervous. <laughs> no, it, it, like, I, I've never been able to do it. It you just kind of sprays nose? out. I blow my nose. That's what happens when you blow your nose. That's a snot rocket. But if I if I try to do a snot rocket, it's just gonna kind of like, you know, go down my face. It's because gonna, you don't have a booger. It's because you're nervous. You need a dry, you good old spherical power. booger in there. I, I, I have I have stage fright with blowing <laughs> snow rock. You know what? The next Trunk Join Live, I'll go on stage and I'll blow one into the audience. <laughs> Aaron gave me the strength to do this. <laughs> right out to some some lucky um, guest in the audience. Just sticks onto one of their teeth and they don't notice for the rest of the show and no one tells That's them. That's disgusting. <laughs> but can you tell, I don't know if Aaron knows the story, can you tell him the story of the Jack Daniels and the, the cheddar cheese? Because it's a great story. Oh. I love have this I story. Have I told you? It's not even there's that big of a payoff. It's no, just it's disgusting just funny. and sad. <laughs> That's all it is. It's like people in the podcast, whatever, like if it's their first time hearing the story, it's always like, oh, this is going to be good. Cheese and Jack Daniels. But we, then like I tell it and it's like, oh, Jesus Christ. Like, That's disgusting. <laughs> Fuck. Like, OK, well, we'll gauge it by your reaction. OK. Aaron. Uh, OK. So one night I was I was just not in the mood. And I and I was I was in my feelings, as Drake would say. Um, Were you doing the dance? <laughs> yeah, I was crying and doing the Drake dance. Um, so I I chugged like half a bottle of Jack Daniels. And that's a lot of liquor. That is a lot. That of is liquor. That, yeah. that is an intense like amount of liquor, right? Yeah. yeah. And then I um, cut a block of cheese that my family had downstairs because I wanted them to have some fashion. cheese. I didn't want to eat the whole cheese. I'm a big cheese fan, by the way. Uh -huh. Like I always have my fridge stocked with. Oh, cheese. when I when I lived fan. with him. It was just he was just eating cheese nonstop. We go to the, like every time we go to the store, it was in the a fridge, problem. It would be like stocked with cheese. With the like, Cracker Barrel he, cheese. He sticks. had his own drawer that like like no one like no, I wouldn't put anything in. It was just a drawer just for Ryan's cheese. I'm not kidding. Like he had his own cheese drawer in the fridge. He ate that much cheese. He'd cover all the corners. Every eating. time I opened up the Ryan! trash can, <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> no. You, you, you would open up our trash can. It would just be like filled with cheese wrappers. Like it, like so much cheese. <laughs> It was good. I like cheese. I can't. I don't no, know. I can't, no one, no one so, can fault you for that. So I cut this block of cheese in half. Yeah. And I'm drunk, and I'm like, I don't feel. I, I'm afraid I'm gonna cut myself with a knife. So I just start, like, eating it. Like just a candy like, bar. Like a candy but bar. But it's cheddar. <laughs> <laughs> this is back when I was in college. Yeah. Like, probably first year of college or something. Yeah. Like that. And then everything and, was I, okay, right? I was not. Well, this wasn't even a part of the college experience. I was just home. Upstairs by myself. You weren't at some like kick ass rager. <laughs> no. You were just by well, yourself. I mean, if I was at a party eating a block of cheese like a candy bar, I don't think that would be a good image. Just well. standing in the corner with a bottle of Jack hey, Daniels and a block of cheddar cheese eating it like a chocolate bar. Just like, hey, hey, look at that guy. Hey, oh my God, is that Ryan? Yeah. <laughs> Dude, you look so cool right now. <laughs> I'm like, yep. <laughs> I'd probably poke a hole in the cheese, put a cigarette in there. So I could like, double task. <laughs> but so I'm eating this block of cheese and everything's going fine. I'm like, ah, I'm going to, I'm going to fall asleep now. And so I fall asleep. And the next thing I know, I'm opening my eyes and you know the shape a fountain makes. It goes straight up, and then it kind of mushrooms. <laughs> yeah. I wake up to that image of throw up, and then it <laughs> falling down onto my face. <laughs> and then I then I lean over the couch and I throw up more, and I'm like, oh, <laughs> like that, like violent throw. Up. And so like I throw up like on the floor, and like there's throw up on me and like on my pillow. But I'm so drunk and exhausted from this experience that I just fall back asleep. <laughs> <laughs> in my own filth so i wake up with like it's in like my hair a little that's how it happens with like just dried cheddar cheese vomit with like the jack daniels kind of scent a little bit <laughs> see was, you're you're was, lucky though because that's a, a lot of people die like you're lucky you woke up yeah, no, so that's the thing vomit, like, yeah. it's a funny story but that's legitimately like that could have been your a coin death. i'm dead or i'm alive <laughs> flip a coin it's a funny haha i threw up all over myself or Oh God! Like Ryan, well, depending book. on the person. Yeah, true. imagine it's if you told some like some middle-aged woman from the south, she'd be like, "Oh my lord, <laughs> yeah, you almost killed yourself." Oh my love, that's disgusting. <laughs> Get out of my house. I just like I, I love that okay. story because you want some cornbread. Use a doily. <laughs> here's a here's a doily. Take a free doily on the way out. I uh 
I love that story. Because, well, it's funny. I wish I could have seen it. Like, if I had, if I had the ghost of like Christmas I, past come to me, did I, I'd be like, "Don't take me to Christmas. Take me to this moment where I can watch Ryan throw up on himself." I have a and picture. That been it. I have a picture from that night. Cause Wait, I, really? Because I sent a Snapchat to Daniel, but I screenshotted that Snapchat because I'm like, I look so wasted. And this and is before I, the I posted something to Instagram, and I don't know why I even. I think I was just trying to be like, bitch. But this is this is that image of that <laughs> night. Let me see. Birch? <laughs> Birch. Oh my god, you're so gone in that picture. When was this? Did I? I oh, I didn't know you yet. That's on my Instagram. How'd That's you amazing. find that so fast? Uh, because I I just scroll down through all. Of, I mean, I don't have too many photos on my Instagram. I don't think. Like, I can't think of like a grosser. Yeah, this vomit. is 2014, baby. 2014. No, this was. 2014. It's four years that was ago. Two, yeah, that was about two years after after high school. 